Hello, hello. Good afternoon slash evening. We're back with more Cyber to Punk. How are you liking the new jams? This is the last three tracks, including this one, are part of the upcoming Phantom Liberty expansion. I fucking love it. I'm so ready. Music's like one of the best parts of of the base game, so you can I, you can tell they're going to be used well. Anyway, 2.0 update today, and uh, Phantom Liberty on the 26th, so five days. Uh, so we get to enjoy 2.0 and try and familiarize ourselves with the extensive changes, which I'll go over here somewhat and uh, in a moment. Um, there's a lot. It's called 2.0 for a reason. The last game version was 1.63, so uh, they've been they've been busy. Uh, and this is, from my understanding, next to Phantom Liberty, the final major update for the game. Anything that comes after this will be bug fixes, really. I don't think we'll see much in the way of uh, any more content expansions. Uh, well, definitely no DLC expansions. They only planned the one... Or, you know, they, they changed trajectories on that anyway. They were originally going to do more. There was going to be multiplayer originally, but, you know, things changed. Um, but yeah, as far as updates go, like this one, we won't see another. So, it better be good. Uh, from what I've seen so far, it looks very neat. Welcome, everyone. I see Red. Red Burns Bailey. It's a combo. Red, no wait, hang on. Red burns Bailey's ass. There you go. All in a row. Perfect. Arts as well. <laughs> Red burns Bailey's ass. Arts. Christ. What a what a mouthful. Uh, but yeah, welcome. I uh, hope you're uh, hope you're doing well. Hope your week's been going well. How am I doing? I'm doing all right. I'm doing all right. Not too bad. Not too bad. <sighs> Cannot complain. I am quite ex uh, excited, really, for the update and everything. So, uh, I'm going to go through some of the deets. Get in that lingo. And uh, oh, I'll put it up on screen here. Might be hard to read because I can't really zoom in any. Thank you, Steam. Very cool. Excuse me, you heard. I ain't repeating myself. Uh, here we go. So... I, I, this is torture for me, by the way. I just want to get in and play the fucking game. Uh, <laughs> but I, I do want to also know what's happened. Um, I've got the gist of it, but there's some stuff that I heard in the stream they did earlier on uh, that that I didn't know of, so it's quite interesting. So we've got the new police system. To summarise, I haven't read this yet, but to summarise, to my knowledge, it's there is one now. Uh, police system before may as well have not existed. It was janky, and it felt very placeholder so, um, you'll actually be chased by police in vehicles now. Vehicle combat is now a part of it, so you can exchange firefights and whatnot. Um, but also, there is a progression to the police now. Max Tac, also known as, I guess, the, the top tier um, form of... Think of it like SWAT. Cyberpunk SWAT, I guess is the best way of putting it. They're really fucking strong, and their main purpose is to take down cyber psychos. So, uh, if you get re if you are really naughty and you cause too much trouble and you get too much of a wanted level, uh, then they'll come after you and fuck you up. So, that's uh, that's the gist of the new police system. But we'll have a look at what it actually says. It's got the NCPD will chase you when you commit a crime, whether on foot or in vehicle. Types of units in a pursuit and their behavior depends on your know, wanted level. Yeah, these chases can include various NCPD vehicles, road roadblocks. Yep, yeah, and max stack sweeping in with AVs. The NCPD will now be present in the world, actively patrolling the streets. Officers uh, working at crime scenes will now engage in pursuits. And uh, yeah, you can now hear NCPD radio chat throughout the uh, through the radio. That's nice. And it's possible to quick hack NCPD officers. Uh, officers. I guess it wasn't before. Oh. 
some of these things are new to me. Vehicle combat, pretty self-explanatory. Uh, you can now engage in combat whilst driving, which sounds very challenging, even on mouse and keyboard, I must admit. How am I supposed to do where I'm driving? I'm not looking. Let's see how glitchy they are. Honestly, I, I'm still adamant that most of the glitches that are going on are just due to outright stress on the GPU. I mean, they still shouldn't be happening if that's the case, right? But it's it's weird that I've seen so many more glitches on this stream through than I have in any other playthrough, modded or not. And I've been playing it unmodded at this point, so I, I think my GPU is, is causing some fuckery, <laughs> for a lack of a better word. Um, that's the only explanation I can come up with. I don't think it's that much of a coincidence. Because that's strange to me. Uh, but yeah, well, I'm sure glitches will be present still, um, as, as they always usually are. But uh, I'm curious if we see any goofy ones like we have been lately. But yeah, vehicle combat. You can hack as well while driving and stuff now. Um, AI combat improvements. AI are going to be much harder now. Um, they're a lot more intelligent in... The way they search for you, if you're stealthing and you've garnered their attention. Um, there's, there's a lot going on here that I don't think a lot of text will do justice. And as they say at the top here, full list of changes would be way too long to publish, but we've listed the most notable ones below. Well, I would really appreciate it if they did publish it on like a paste bin or whatever the fuck, just somewhere on their website. I would love to see all of it because I'm a nerd like that. Um, Improvements to Netrunner AI, um, you know, Netrunners will now attack you with more uh, attacks, different hacks and stuff. Uh, remove the option to use breach protocol on enemies, okay. It's so substantial a change that none of this is going to work how I, I, uh, y you know what? This is neat and all. But I'm not going to sit here and... I mean, this this is a an abridged list. And it's still... Substantial. <laughs> um, quest fixes. The, these are the things I definitely want to look at. It's like... Um, oh shit, they've added it now. So... There's two new radio stations. Three new radio stations. Impulse 99.9 .9 features a completely new set of songs remixed by Idris Elba. If you weren't aware, the mad lad is, uh, is quite uh, skilled in many areas. He's a DJ as well, from my understanding, so that fits. Uh, 107.5 Darkstar is a new station for electronic music and 89.7 Growl FM features songs created by our community. The DJ Ash is voiced by Sasha Gray. I'm sure if you know, you know. Um, but yeah, the I, I remember seeing this competition quite a while back. Um, I think it was last year even, where the community could submit music and um, it would be voted on and the, the most popular ones would end up in the game. And uh, there was actually a bit of controversy around it, um, which was that somebody submitted music that, like, wasn't theirs. <laughs> or something to that extent. Some music that was... It, it was not... Is not all theirs. So uh, I can't remember the exact details on it, but, uh, yeah, that, that got pulled and... One of the other ones got promoted up. But uh, yeah, we'll be curious to listen to those off stream because I doubt I'll be able to listen to them on stream without getting it hit. Synthwave, probably? I doubt it because, you know, some of it might be, but like not much of the music in this game is actually Synthwave. Um, quest fixes. Uh, be on the brat, the Glen. Fix an issue where. It wasn't possible to draw fists when the fight started. Never had that. Blistering Love fixed an issue where the pack card despawned after talking to Rogue in front of the afterlife. Never had that. Cyber Psycho sighting Blood Ritual fixed an issue where Zarya's body 
You'd get stuck underground after defeating her. No, never had that. <laughs> Forward to death. The force is defending the gate uh, of the construction site now. Properly attacked. No. Kick serious side effects. Fixed an issue. Is it possible to deposit? No. Never. A lot of these I don't think I've ever had. Or any of them even. Fix an issue where it's possible to get stuck in Red Queen's race after completing the quest. That sounds familiar. I might have actually had that once already. Uh, Queen of the Highway. Fix an issue where it wasn't possible to complete the Talk to Panam objective. An order saves. No, I had that. Spellbound. It's now possible to steal the data from Reno's computer if you don't have a cyber deck. Well. It's never been an issue for me. Uh, we got to live together. Fix an issue where an invisible wall made it impossible to return to the camp on the basilisk. That's interesting. Yeah, I, I'm always certain I've not had any of these, and if I have, I only have had one. Um, but it's it's neat that they're fixing some of these things. Still, well, that's the thing. I think a lot of these are going to be hardware dependent. They're going to be all about like optimizations and stuff. Like I've never had these. Um, some of these. Are like very specific like being able to steal the data from Reno's computer if you don't have a cyber deck and it's like when do you never have a cyber deck right I assume if you've got like a berserk or sound of stan then maybe but I don't know, yeah I've, a lot of these issues will probably be like only for very specific people on specific hardware um, stability and performance uh, it's interesting that they're improving performance and uh, yet the the new requirements for the game are going up and I don't know if that's them just covering their asses a bit um, I booted the game up very briefly in my apartment in game I got solid 60 uh, and it wasn't budging but um, we'll see I guess with the stream on as well miscellaneous added trauma drama an arcade minigame that offers a chance to win special rewards. Okay, another arcade game. Cool. Any more secrets to be discovered in Night City? Neat. That's nice and vague. Uh, added small scenes to the game, including some conversations with Johnny Silverhand when visiting V's apartment in Mega Building H10. Oh, okay. Uh, you can now change tattoos at Ripper Docks. You can now choose between three control schemes for controls, classic, dynamic, and alternative. Apartments will now give smaller buffs. Smaller buffs? Okay. Updated the characters tab in the database to include more side characters, right? Added new niches at the columbarium. Okay. Uh, Add Ukrainian text localization. Also very neat. And then PC specific PC system requirements have been updated. SSD is now required to run the game. Um, they don't say like it. They say required, but really what they mean is extremely highly recommended <laughs> because you can still run the game on a hard drive but like you're probably gonna have data streaming issues because well you know how it is modern games and all that support for dlss 3.5 which has been added um does apply to my gpu but most certainly won't be uh, a concern for me because i don't run ray tracing um AMD stuff. Crowd density setting has been moved from the gameplay tab to the graphics tab. That makes sense. One, I always wondered why it was there, given that it took a hit to CPU. Additionally, crowd density is now tied to the graphics quick presets. It will change depending on the selected preset, but it can be customized independently if needed. As PC system requirements have been updated, running the game on an SSD is now a requirement on Steam Deck. Updated Steam Deck graphics profile for improved frame rate stability. All right. There is more, you know, there is a lot more UI changes, vendors. You can now access the wardrobe feature through clothing vendors. That's neat. Yeah, I, I would love to sit here and read all this, but I'd also much rather just fucking play the game. So should we do that? Let's go. Oh, the game's crashed immediately. <laughs> oh dear. I wonder if that's because I tabbed out as it was booting. 
I think I upset it. It's weird, because I already launched it off-stream once. May again, maybe we're coming back to the fact that the GPU just can't handle both. Let's try again. If it crashes again, I'm not going to be happy. I have no mods installed or anything. Seems to have launched this time. Yeah. Here we go. To be fair, I've had that problem before. Where, like, on the first launch, it can sometimes hitch and then just auto crash, but. It seems that it's the same weird thing. to a solid and sturdy 30. 10 out of Haywood. Thanks to unabated gang wars. One officer down, so I guess you're all screwed. Cause the NCPD will not let that go. Got another blackout in Santo Domingo. Netrunners are at it again, poking holes in the power grid. While over in Westbrook, trauma teens scraping cyber psycho victims off the pavement. And in Pacifica, well, Pacifica is still Pacifica. This has been your man, Stan. Join me for another day in our city of dreams. Just using the time in the intro there to chug some of my coffee. Now, they really highly recommend that you start a new game, but, um... Fuck that shit. Um... Up here, you've got a brief overview of the update as well. But we don't need that. We're just gonna... Load straight in here. Tonight is Lieutenant Sarah Kokoski, spokeswoman for the Yeah, NCPD. buddy. Burns, you know it. Welcome to the show. Uh, hello, Ziggy. Ah, I fucking Thanks love this game, me. man. I, uh, I'm super... In like, immediately we're seeing differences in the UI. This is all new. Um, it felt very clunky before. But you can see the game is still very much running in the background. Before it would just pause it and go into its own menu, but... Um... Another new feature here we're getting from one of the fixes is uh, the new way to buy cars. You don't have to go in person to every location to pick up a car anymore. You can just buy it through the net. Some new sounds. Yeah, this whole UI, this is a lot easier to use. Because before it was very clunky and a bit broken. You know, once you get used to it, it's uh It's 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 you avoid these issues quite easily, but now with a completely overhauled UI, they'll be gone, hopefully. You can call someone straight from the text messages, which is nice as well. And better yet, at the top here. You can switch between contacts, and they're in the order of the last person you spoke to, which sounds like a real obvious thing, and it is, and I have no reason why in the base game there wasn't like a sorting order to these things. It felt very random, in fact, the order they put them in. The only time it'd ever help you by putting something at the top is when there was a quest objective that was tied to contacting someone, it would be right at the top of the list. Uh, that's like only the 10, 20% of scenarios. So yeah, I'm getting 62 FPS, which is what I'm capped at within the apartment, which is good. But uh, we'll see once we get into the city, shall we? I'm just going to finish my coffee and then we'll uh, we'll check some shit out, shall we? We're going to have to respec as well. Christ, we're going to have to respec heavy. Move that over there, we, we don't want that in the way. Let's 
sorry about that. I've just got a bunch of thumb drives and stuff right near where my USB cable for my mouse is because my mouse is a bit low on charge and it needs charging because I'm going to be here a while. Don't know how long the stream's going to be, but uh, I could quite happily be here until midnight, I think. So uh, maybe, maybe expect a long one. Um, I'm just picking up on small UI differences already. Um, the interaction button there at the bottom of the screen. Uh, the icon has a black background now. Uh, even the main UI in the bottom left there, it's, there's a bit of verticality to it now, rather than it all just being horizontal. It's just a bit more compressed. I, I wouldn't say it <laughs> stands out as being clearly better or worse, but um, let's have a look at our character screen then. So, due to significant changes in the gameplay mechanics, your perks have been reset and your perk points have been refunded, allowing you to rebuild your character however you like. Also, down here in the bottom left, um, this is specifically only once and for ongoing playthroughs of the game prior to 2.0. So what this will do is it will reset all of these to three, which has never been an option in the game up until now, and it's purely for the purpose of allowing existing saves to work with the current game. So we're going to do that, because all the perks are different now. And um, if you were here for the previous streams or you watched the previous VODs, if you're watching the VODs right now, hello, thanks for watching. Uh, but this is all very different. We looked at it a bit on the stream with the build planner that's on the website, but uh, it's very overwhelming to look at to begin with, that's for sure. Now, I like this, is that you can level up the attribute that you're within without having to back out and do it here and go back in and then back out. Um, you can also switch between each of the trees. This feels like a UI design that's finished. I don't mean to discredit the work they put in, but so much of Cyberpunk was just very either placeholder feeling or not. It's just not had the polish that it needed. Um... And truthfully, I think this is exactly what it should have been at day one. But uh, I still appreciate the commitment to finishing it. Uh, it's in their best interests too, I, as well, I guess, because, you know, if you're trying to launch an IP, then the last thing you want to is to have a disastrous launch of your first game in that IP and then not give it the love it deserves, because who's going to trust you from that point on? Um, but they're committed to it, and I like that, because I really, really enjoy this uh, this universe they've got going on. Anyway, um, now, from my understanding, reflexes is where you want to be at, because there's some very important skills here that stand out to me. It's this center section of the tree here. Um, it's mainly for this, because that shit looks insane. Blades are here as well, and I really fucking want to... Be able to do that shit. Unlocks the ability to block incoming projectiles with blades. This consumes stamina, as it should. So I think we're going to go into reflexes mainly. Um, but there's a lot of new stuff. And I'm not even going to try and learn it and comprehend it now. I think we're just going to play it. We're, we're not going to think about the things we're upgrading into. And worst comes to worst. There's uh, a app out there that allows you to redistribute your points or give you your points back, basically, and um, call it cheating. I don't really care. Uh, I've played and completed this game enough times now. Um, if I make a mistake with a build or I commit to a path because I, I don't understand where it's going, I'd rather do that and learn that way than have to sit here for a very, very long time and, and look uh, at everything to plan a build ahead of time. And it's why they gave the build planner, but I, I rather learn through uh, experience than, than sitting there trying to memorize it all. Anyway, is it live on console? It bloody well should be. From my understanding, it should have been live across all platforms around the same time, which was about an hour ago. But 
they are really at the whim of the different platforms and how they feed out updates. So I know mine came a little later than some others, and some other people probably had it later than me as well. Um, if in doubt, restart the system if you've got your console on, and maybe it will check for an update again. If not, yeah, you're just going to have to be patient, I think. Um, right. Like I say, reflexes look good. Reflexes has always been a skill tree I've leveled quite heavily into because it's always a good shout, but it's so much different now. You know, um, I love this. Unlocks premium new ways to exit vehicles. Jump out, double tap F, slide out, hold F while at high speed. You can also draw and fire weapons during these stunts. Fuck yeah, bud. Right. Okay. I want that just because it's badass. Um... Also, you move the more difficult enemies to, uh, for... Yeah. Yeah. This this tree is sounding very melee intensive, which I'm I'm totally into. I see a shoot while sprinting, sliding, and vaulting. Now, um... Now, this does seem quite... But this is a skill that existed before, but it seems a lot more justifiable to get now. Also, there are some skills that are completely gone, like if you've been watching the previous streams, then you'll know that uh, crafting was a big part of the technical tree. But it just isn't anymore. Crafting is is really just built into the game now as abilities are concerned like there's not but before in vanilla if you really wanted to be able to craft the best shit you needed this to be like level 20 and you needed intelligence to be level 18 or whatever that's like a lot of your build now for build diversity they're allowing you to sort of like there's still buffs in here like it's saying but this is more for abilities I like the uh, the nod to edge runners here. Uh, the the anime that came out got David Martinez in these two shots. License to Chrome plus ten percent to all cyware stat modifiers. Uh, another thing to keep in mind is armor is now not tied to clothes, so there's nothing here. No no real reason for me to wear any of this. And again, not really much point for transmog other than to um, be able to change outfits on the fly, right? That's interesting. That's freaked out a bit there. He's not meant to have a top on underneath that. <laughs> oh well. God, this is, this is all very overwhelming, I'm going to be quite honest with you. Wait, did I not? I thought I added... Hmm. Maybe, oh yeah, because the sideways all changed, so I'm going to have to go back and have a look at that. Like, let's have a look at... Oh, we can't here. Oh, here we go. Yeah, like, only some of this is carried over. You hear all the noises and UI differences? M immersion. So you upgrade your uh, your cyberware now, or it upgrades with your level, I should say. Um, I think you can also upgrade it. Got to visit a ripper dock for it though. Um, you can also. Um, oh yeah, okay. You, you do need to change it at a ripper dock as well, but uh, it's nice that you can view it all. nice. Again, UI is just working as intended now. Although... Okay, that did change when I came out. But, uh, you, I don't know if you noticed that. You got the UI noises going on. And then if you... I like this feature that you can... It's like, oh, to unlock this you need to go to the skill tree. But then the sound continues. When you go back it doesn't take you back there and it's still there be a, a little 
Uh, a little bug fix for that, I'm sure. Uh, do we need to st uh, Do we have to start a new character for the update? No. But everyone's been saying they prefer you to start over, but I think that's mainly just because they want you to experience everything from the ground up. Falls of motorsport. Uh, no, just to start from the beginning so that you get to see everything from the beginning. Um, they have totally designed it with continuing existing saves in mind, though. So you can refund all your points and your skills and everything. And it'll be fine, but if, if you do want to start again, it's, uh, or you don't mind starting again, then that's probably why. I literally just started again a few days ago, so I can't be asked. but... Hello, Bean. Bean says hi. And, uh, yeah, well, uh, we'll continue with this. I, I want this. Increased damage and stun chance with counter attacks. Bullet deflect. When your stamina is above 33%, bro blocking projectiles deflect them to wherever your reticle is aimed. Oh yeah. All time blocking just before being hit increases the damage you deal with deflected bullets. So like a parry buff, that's fucking neat. Yes please. Whenever time is slowed, bullet deflect does not consume stamina, and deflections automatically hit enemies for crit damage. <laughs> Mate, this sounds... This sounds fun, from a gameplay perspective. Um, get the dash as well. Man, I'm just gonna end up getting everything in this tree. So overall, there is actually less perks now. And, um... Some things are just gone. Like, I don't know if any of these work quite like the others did, but before, there was, um, when you hit level 20, there was a unique perk for each tree that you could level into indefinitely, but they're gone now, which is kind of sad to see. It'd be nice to have something like that, you know, for people who maybe mod the game and unlock the level cap. Because the level cap in this game is 50 by default, and with Phantom Liberty that'll be up to 60 from my understanding. But, uh... And I get why, because you don't want it to be build diversity to the point where you can have every perk and skill in the game, right? Because... Talk about overpowered and overwhelmed. Um... But it's nice to have the option, uh, and some perks that sort of work well with that, but that's fine. Allows you to shoot while dashing. Plus 100% mitigation chance when performing a dash. Plus 40% stamina after neutralizing an enemy while dashing. Oh, okay. Plus 100% dash range towards enemies. I like the sound of that. I'm also gonna keep leveling into this a bit more. Getting low on perk points though already, so um, gonna have to get the melee weapon out and make sure that's upgraded here in a moment. Minus twenty percent dash stamina cost, plus twenty percent dash speed, and then unlocks the ability to dash in midair. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna be ridiculous. I'm gonna leave that for now though. Um... Oh, you know what, fuck it. It's all going into this tree, I don't care. Um, I think I'm probably just gonna level fully into reflexes. Because this tree... It's- it's the tree for me, okay? But, as far as other things go... I think... Body is also a good shout, because of the healing stuff. So, let's just put the rest in the body for now and forget about it because we're only level 14 and there's much more to come. Right, let's go get kitty. Sleepy kitty. Um, let's go get our blade.
Maybe we should try the uh, black unicorn. Can't check my weapon out here. Let's go outside real quick. Oh, incoming. Avi, hope it's not a bad time. Uh, some news trickled down the Ripper grapevine. Thought it might interest you. Cut the foreplay, Vic. Spill. <laughs> well, some implant soft updates just hit the streets. Completely fresh batch. Useful as hell, Ripper say. Drop the dime to you first, because, well... I'm rooting for you, kid. I'd love to see you get ahead of the pack. What's in the batch? You know, system streamlining, new subroutines, expanded user settings. Uh, you'll need to see. Hot tip. Thanks, Vic. Now, how might one nab this wonder update? Well, just about every Ripper dock in town, actually. So, not that much wonder at all, I'm afraid. Oh, you can hook me up too. Sure thing. Swing by any time. So, also new for 2.0 is that in interaction. Um, basically, making us aware of all the new gubbins that come with the update as far as cyberware is concerned. So, how much money do we have? Fuck all, because we literally just upgraded last time. And uh, some of that doesn't seem to be relevant anymore. But, and also, I think this is another reason why they highly recommend you start a new playthrough, is because the economy and world balance has changed. So how much money you get from completing gigs and stuff now is much higher. But the amount of loot you get in the world is lower. Um, they were talking about how you can't really loot clothes off of dead enemies anymore because it's kind of weird. If you think about it, and I, I really had never thought about it, but yeah, I guess picking up clothes off a corpse you just massacred, either pumped full of holes or cut through with a blade, not going to be the best clothes to, <laughs> to wear, are they? Um, but clothes don't really have that purpose anymore of, of being about armor. So before it was very much grab the, cl the thing with the highest number and wear that, and then they added the transmog so that you can make yourself not look stupid whilst also maintaining that. And now they seem to have completely done away with the whole problem of I look like a fucking idiot because I'm just wearing the armor that has the highest values, right? Um, but it, it, I think I like the direction they've gone in regards to that because Transmog's still useful to have multiple outfits on the fly if you like role-playing like that. Um, for me, I somewhere in the middle. I. You like your character to look badass, right? But um, now that it's not imperative to my my playthrough, I, I won't be staring at it quite as much. Um, it's what's in style, ripped clothes, yeah. It's it coming back in fashion, I guess. These are looking very unripped, though. Uh, where's the crafting tab? Here. It's in, in the inventory now, okay. That's that's good, that's probably where it should be. These uh, icons look interesting. All the bread on them. Almost makes me look like, uh, makes it look like they're locked. Isn't it? Um, so where's, where's me blade? Hang on. Upgrades, there we go. Insufficient components, I need blue components. That would upgrade it to tier 3 iconic, okay. Damage per hit goes up substantially. I think maybe we should go and get ourselves some components. Components are way... are used way more now as well. Um, so I'm going to need even more of them, which is why it's good that we're getting more money for stuff, because I was always buying the fuckers anyway, right? Um, Map looks the same. I'm on the dynamics screen though, so... I don't know, maybe it's a little more polished up? It doesn't actually look identical. Like, the blues look a bit punchier and it 
the contrast of it all seems a bit higher, but I might be imagining that. Like the blues of this topography over here, it makes it stand out a bit more. But maybe it's because I'm looking for it, you know. Uh, I'm no longer getting prompts for difficulty. And from my understanding, they level enemies a lot more with you now. So I'm curious if I go straight into downtown here, which is the highest level area in the game, as of 1.63, how that will work out. I just realized I've never been over here. Like, ever. Dogtown's on the map. Oh. Okay, so... They've actually added everything in already. This was never like this before, for those who, who were curious. Um, I wish I could f find you a side-by-side -side example, but... Um, like, this is the new area on the map, so it doesn't really look all that big. But, uh... Oh, you can still go in person and purchase the vehicles. Yeah. Some of this... Like, a bit of this all looks new. Like, I don't remember this over... Wait, no. Yeah, I do. This is... This is still the same. I just don't really look over here on this part of the map, usually. But yeah, I, I I might go over here just to see what it looks like, you know, because um, obviously we won't be able to go in just yet. But, um... Yeah. Let's go fucking check some stuff out, shall we? First of all, I want to go and check out an NCPD... Hustle. Let's go to that one. Actually, I can probably fast travel to Arasaka Tower. <sighs> oh, they still haven't fixed that bug, though, in the loading screen. If you know, you know. If you don't, you don't. Rage! Whoa! Fury! Carnage! My ears! Follow your instincts! Fucking jump scared. Vehicle's been re repaired after suffering an unfortunate Okay, so that was a lot quicker than the base game. I find in base game it takes quite a lot of time for this to actually happen, so... But we've got three vehicles to choose from now. You know it's got to be the V10 E3 car, right? Have they... Again, maybe I'm just looking for shit, but that was here immediately. I've lost count of times how many times this would bug out. It'd spawn in, you'd look to your right, and it's just sitting over there and wouldn't come to you. So we'll have to keep an eye on, um, on that as a feature and see how well it holds up. Also, car sounds have been reworked a, a good bit. This sounds different on board. Sounds a lot meatier. It sounds so much cooler. The, the fucking pops and crackles. Ah! Awesome. I need to get under. The question is. How do you pull your weapon out? Oh, there we go. Doing. So I volunteered you. 
Do it well, and you'll get your audience with Brigitte. What's this task needs doing? What? You gonna go picky on me now? The contact will fill you in on the deets. I got zero from him. Actually, got the impression I'd have to pay for every word out of his mouth. Okay. So who do I talk to and how? Hit the chapel on Sloan. Look for the altar inside. Someone will touch you, nod to you. Something spooky. Got it. Thanks. So, Mr. Hans is going to be a fairly decent have a de fairly decent role in the expansion that's coming out. Uh, in the base game, he has very little uh, presence. You know, he introduces himself. He is in the main quest line, as you just heard. That's part of the main quest line. Um, in the last session, we called him because we need to get in contact with the Voodoo Boys. And he's gotten back to us about that. But he's been revoiced and redesigned, uh, it seems. Um, they've done a really good job of trying to keep his voice close to the original, though, as far as, like, the... The filters and everything over the top but it still sounds you can still tell like the way it's delivered is different as well but um i think it's not as jarring as i thought it would be of a change anyway but yeah i thought that was neat but, yeah so how does this work? Press left control to form a dash. Oh, okay. Well, he went down fairly quick. Okay, you can double tap the direction as well. So in the base game, there's like... There's a small sidestep you can do. This should make hand-to-hand -hand combat a lot easier as well, being able to do this. I like that. Okay. You see that? Dash in the- oh my god! And because of, like, the, gl the ground is made of glue, look at the momentum you carry. I stopped. I stopped holding the input once I get on the air. Watch this. You just slide for a bit. <laughs> so how do you crouch now? What's my crouch button? Oh, it is still the same. Huh. Interesting. Right, well, I'm probably going to die here, but let's go get stuck in. First of all, I think my point was proven, is we're in downtown, the highest level area in the game, and that combat was very doable. Which means you can go fucking anywhere from the get-go in the game now, I love that. Um, I'm not... Th before, there was very much a process on the hardest difficulties to how you would play the game. You'd start up, you'd do a lot within Watson, so that you could get leveled up, and then you'd come over here and you'd go into... Uh, Westbrook and then you'd work around here until you leveled up a certain amount and then maybe you go to the Badlands or you can come here into um, the fucking Santo Domingo there was very much an order and then you come here last you go Hayward as well like there, there was a process to it because of just how over leveled everything was against you in those areas but the thing is in those areas the levels were capped at a certain point anyway so Beyond level 34, everything was just piss. Now, it should l everyone should level with you, and that'll be great. See that? He's, he's not sheathing it, but... Sort of... He's chilling. Got it. Got it, really. Um, what the fuck's this? Listen, I know you... 
I know, I know, you've got inflation due to prices are sky high, everything's going to shit, yada yada, but what? Uh, but that's why life's little pleasures are so important, B. If not now, when? Come on, hop on autofix already. <laughs> he won't leave me alone. Too much biz. Just want what's best for you, V. And it just so happens Autofix has got the best wheels in Night City. Well, speaking of the captain, and another one. Oh, yeah. Uh, not yet. Hey, Matt. Good to see you. Oh. Hang on. I actually haven't done the job. That was just a random encounter with some enemies. Okay. Fuck, I love that. I can't wait to get, like, the legs, cyberware and everything, and really increase the mobility. Okay, now that guy is overleveled, look. The skull. Should we see how overleveled they are? That overleveled. <laughs> that answers that. <laughs> Alright, I take it all back. It wasn't quite as I was expecting. I'm hoping, though, that they're a lot more viable to go wherever you like than it was before, but we'll only find out via trying that one. I want to quickly see how. Actually, uh, why am I crouching? Oh, I'm out of stamina, though, that's for sure. Oh no, I'm not. I'm gonna fuck you a brand new asshole. Oh yeah? Don't make promises you can't keep! Sounded hot. Yo, we Oh, so I can block bullets now. I keep forgetting. So, there was finishers. Did I unlock the finishers? Uh, no, I didn't. Bean! Hey! Didn't scratch the sofa. A little prick. Hey, Screamlight. I am doing quite well. Yep. Yeah. I know very little about Cyberpunk. They've, they've had a bad day. They have. They've lost their heads. Um, yeah, Cyberpunk, it's, it's an aesthetic more than anything. But the, the source material is, uh, is a board game. Sort of similar to D&D &D in a way. Just lighter. In the, in the mechanics, and again, rather than this fantasy setting, well, it's still fantasy, but it's like dystopian future, where, you know, the whole point of Cyberpunk, the board game anyway, is um, it's that style over substance. Uh, I think one of the lines from the playbook is, if you fail, make sure you do it in... You go out with a bang, and you make it look like that was the intention all along. I don't think it all carries over into the game, but it's very much like... 
an aesthetic thing, which is why a lot of the cars look weird. I'm not so sure I think that asymmetric design suddenly is cyberpunk, but <laughs> that is definitely the aesthetic they've gone for. You can't just spam heals anymore either, by the way, that's, uh... Oh. Oh. Okay. Stamina went low and they just destroyed me. Fair enough. I shouldn't be fucking with them. But the fact that it's even viable to get stuck in for a bit is cool. Because before... You just die instantly. So I, I'm, I'm still adamant I was somewhat correct with the whole they're leveled closer to you now. Let's try it one more time. There's a cop over there. Glamo. That guy caught me off guard. Dialogues. The, 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 a lot of these seem new. I don't remember engaging with animals all that often, so um, I, I definitely don't recognize some of these lines, but holy shit. Yeah, it definitely wants to squeeze me dry. Oh, he's gonna blow himself up, surely. Alright, it's got a sand everston. Are so much more insane. Oh. I can't heal yet either. Where's the cooldown for that? Do I just have no heals left? No, I have heals. Or do I not? Hang on. Oh, okay. So these, you just don't have a number of them. You just have it. Yeah, and then you get these durations. Okay. There we go. I uh, could hear a sound effect kick in. Using Never. using bullet. Oh 
my god, they hit her. Oh, you bastard. He knocked me down. Oh, my God. The fight's already way more diverse than it used to be. It's so much better. Oh, my God. The game before was not really... Like, I, admittedly, I'm fighting against people above my level, but there's diversity in the combat they're doing. Um, they're not brainlessly standing in the open, and they're using the cyberware as well. So that guy dashed into me, knocked me on my ass, and then one of the other ones shot me while I was on the ground. Like, god damn! <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna- I'm gonna leave those guys alone, because they- they fuck. <laughs> Can confirm. They skull fuck. <laughs> I'll come back for them another time. We need to level up a bunch. That's what we need to do. Uh, missed me. Came in too hot. <sighs> right, that's um. Let's go. Let's go back to um. To Watson. Courier Services facility. You're gonna break in, clap it. If you want to know what's in the ride, check the attachment. Uh, they've confirmed that the like the new requirements are with this update, and uh, like I just said, I, I'm not noticing a difference either, which is great. Um, I assume it's mostly just to cover their own asses, and maybe the things that really take the load are in the new areas because it looks like a very dense area. So I can imagine. Like, at the beginning of the game, the intro for the Street Kid, that's probably one of the harshest areas for uh, graphical load. Um, just because it's so dense with detail, and I expect the, the new areas to be like that as well, so we'll see. Alright, I'm gonna quickly switch these around. Uh, a nice touch that I like is that the SMGs now use pistol ammo instead of rifle ammo. So, uh... You're not sharing the same ammo type and cutting through it like a motherfucker. That's, that, that was something I found a bit frustrating. Um, let's... Let's get the LMG going there. Uh, check upgrades. It not letting me upgrade anything else and I assume that's just because it's at the level already whatever now this one I remember this one could be quite difficult as well but let's uh well I can't get in that way any oh I can get through here though fuck it let's just get stuck in Oh, 
It's not working. That's a bit weird. Oh my god. Okay. You can't dash up. That would be a bit OP. Oh, they are chasing after me as well. Nah. Too much of a beating. Well, like that. That they chase after you. Because, uh, like I say, I've struggled with that one before, e even at this level. And, um... They just won't chase you out of the compound. They'll just stay within it. But, but now that seems to be not the case, which is cool. I'm going to sneeze. One second. Sorry about that. 50 sneeze streak. No. I had to go get some... Some tissue. Right. Let's try this again, but maybe a little less... Mealy. I meant to do. Uh, it's because I died and it switched back to this grenade type. They bunch up on you. You've got to keep moving. You've got to keep moving. Okay. I feel like I want to be a much higher level so I can just have all these abilities and use them in a fight. It's, uh... Alright. Jesus, they hit hard. Right. I know what we definitely need. Is a shotgun instead. Oh! Shotgun's way better to start with, though. 
pistol for longer range. And, uh... And then a shotgun for when they're right in my face, because that seems to work. It's the knockback that really does it on that one. Yeah, for sure, Bailey. Like, they will just bunch up on you. There's... Before, there was a certain logic where if they got within... I don't know the best way of describing it. It's like, if they were within sight and they didn't have any cover that they could use and they took a hit, they would immediately back off and backtrack to find cover way further away. But they seem to use a lot more of the environment now. And more importantly, if they've got the numbers, they will just brute force their way into wherever you're hiding and just fuck you up. So <laughs> I haven't really got many places I can sit around here. The best way to do this is stealth and go in through the back, but I mean, combat's fun, so plenty of time for stealth at other points. That's for sure. Easy there, Tiger. Alright, let's go. See if we can do it real quick. See how quickly they follow me. The sound of everything, firearms, vehicles, it all sounds a lot better. Oh. Rip that guy. Oh, oh shit. Whiff, 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 whiff. Squirting nub. I'd get that looked at. Hang on. 
Okay. So breach protocol is like really gone. It's going to take some adjusting, that's for sure. Well, I guess when they said there was much less loot, they meant in the world. Maybe like individual items, because I swear I'm picking up a lot still, or the same amount. All their weapons, maybe, I don't know. Uh, it doesn't bother me. That's quite all right. Loot is good for me. I get what they were saying, though, which is that you don't really want to have to be going around like the game is in two phases, like I'm doing right now. Yeah, I think he's already dead, guys. Not sure what the giveaway is, but uh, something tells me. <laughs> oh, yeah, and the corpse is out here. Whoa. I'm going to keep doing that by accident, I think. Whoa. <laughs> anyway, let's go get this van. But yeah, trying to divide up the whole looting from from the, the fighting because it's it's quite mundane to go through a phase of really high intense gameplay to right now let's go pick up a full of corpses okay so even my basic cyber deck has changed like everything got rebalanced in that uh e955 okay. easy give me the goodies there was only one to get there, actually, as well. I did. I just noticed that. You can put that away because that's getting like obnoxious. Anything else to hack? I don't think I can hack this one. I'm not high enough level. Yeah, I didn't loot this shit. Bit of money. Bit of money. Alright. Hey, Nick. Oh, it's running on a flat. He got a hit. That sucks. I guess I'm just driving it on a flat. Flat tires weren't a thing, either. Oh, loving it so far, Nick. Let's deal with these before they get stuck in with the fight as well. That was... That was close to me dying. Range seems improved as well. 
Need science tech weapons now. I don't know. I wouldn't imagine so, but there's so much in this update that who knows? Oh. Jesus Christ, that smart weapon is a bit insane. Oh, he's just set himself on fire. What a galaxy brainer. Just let him come to us. Over here, shit bags. Bruh, really? Enemies are healing a lot more now. God damn it. Finally. Yeah, I haven't had any interactions with the cops yet, but I've, se I've been seeing cops walking around the streets a bunch, which is neat. Like, I, I, I saw that, you know, you can see a lot of combat interactions with cops and, uh, you know, other NPCs and stuff. You know, like gang members and shit, which is neat. Hey, I don't think I know you. I'm Claire. You might not remember me. Bartender at the afterlife? Uh-oh. Got to close my tab. Far as a buzz about you lately, as the mark who's reliable gets things done. And since I need help, okay. Need a driver for street races. Drop by my auto shop. I'll tell you more. Your garage. Where is it? In Arroyo, on Valley. Lovely spot. Can't miss it. All right. I'll try not to. If I'm not there when you arrive, just hang. I'll show up after my shift at the after. Okay. See you, Claire. Whoops. Fan received. Textbook example of a job well done, don't you think? A plus plus. Contract closed. Uh, 20 street credit already. Level 15. I think... Even though I don't have much money, we should go to a ripper dock and just have a look, you know? So... <laughs> yeah, it's, go it's gonna be the next paid DLC, Benny. They're gonna, they're gonna be like, hey, so... Narrate your life <laughs> by... <laughs> how, how many A-list stars can we get in this game? That's the challenge. Uh, oh, this is... No, this is on custom, so... Where's the river box? <laughs> now, I think you can get... See, that hasn't been fixed. Um, I think you can buy literally anything from any ripper dock now, so... There's no... There's no, like, having a hunt around to find each great item, but, uh... I don't know if I feel good or bad about that. I kind of like that each Ripper Dock was kind of unique, but... Eh. It's not a great loss, but... No. So I want to level this up one more time so I can now... do the blade finisher. Press F when an enemy's health is low. I want to watch that. That shit sounds fun. <laughs> And then we can do one more tribute, put it in body for now. Mobility on foot is such a big thing now. You can just move really fast. And there is some leg side wear that can help you run even faster, so I might be getting that.
You the recenter? There you go. See cop walking on the street there. Where am I going? Wrong way. Is this is this really friendly for uh, for streams? <laughs> yeah, I mean I've got the copyrighted music turned off apparently. But um we'll see, I guess. Well, that's cool. This thing handles like shit like it should. Those effects of those grenades looks different. Oh shit. Oh god damn it. Yeah, what the fuck? Oh. Cops! Officer wounded! Oh, I got shot in the ass by the enemy. I got caught in between two! I don't know how I triggered that. I must have killed the civilian by accident with a grenade or something. Fair play, really. Stuck in there. Come on, show us some skin. Oh, I should have used the finisher. Damn. Hey, Maelstrom's got a cyber psycho problem. I want him alive, so really try here. And be careful. Maelstromers are crazy. Psychosis or not. Yeah, the dash is is a skill in the reflex tree. I got that one pretty much immediately. Oh, you know what? okay. <laughs> Not what I meant to do. But nice leg. Yeah, it's uh, this one here, and you can get the air dash, which is very nice. And then. Air dashes do not cost stamina. Woo! I want that. I should have got that. Oh, let me get the next level up. Hey, Who's going? Hey. You hear me? Loud and clear. You don't need to yell. What's up? Doing a little competition. Shooting. Prizes and all. You know, over here with the range. <laughs> yeah, that it makes sense. Well, you in? I didn't think big parties were your thing. Yeah, well, it ain't a big one, but, you know, running low on heads. Let it bring in the clients. Attract them and shit. Could try selling iron straight from the factory. Skip the whole part where you tinker for hours on each little shooter. V, my dignity, please. <laughs> sure, I'm in. When? Well, uh, right now. We'll wait on you. See ya. Oh, 
Oh yeah, look at that. Beautiful. How's Biz treating you, Cassius? Lately? Can't complain. MaxTac raided a black clinic not long past. Since then, custom accounts gone up, and so my prices. Coincidence? <laughs> you decide. Now that people actually reference MaxTac, it doesn't feel quite as stupid. <laughs> now that they actually do exist in the world. Uh, um... Um... Um, I'm confused. Oh, I think I need to equip these. Yeah, okay. So, so, so because... Oh, okay, and we've got here as well. It's like a tutorial to this. Yeah, and then everything else unlocks. Okay. So I imagine that's why... Um, they recommend starting a new game as well. It's probably because when you see Victor for the first time, he sorts you out with these, but things are quite different looking here. Cassius doesn't have anything to buy. Oh, I can sell him some stuff, but I'll figure that out in a bit. Um, Jenkins' tendons. There you go. Increases sprint speed, starting at 30% and then tapering off at 10% after 5 seconds. If continued sprinting, the effect recovers at the same rate when not sprinting. And each one gives a little buff in certain areas, like 0.5 explosion damage resistance. Double jump. Link's paws have a purpose now as well. <laughs> Carrying capacity increased as well. It adds armor, you see, like... Ah, it's... It's... I think it's going to take some adjusting to, and then I think I am going to prefer it, but at first, like, there are some things I'm not immediately gelling with. So I've got a limit on my cyberware here, so I can't, I can't equip much more. But I think doing the double jump will be important, so I'm going to buy that. I'm going high mobility at the moment, so having the double jump means I'll be able to do a dash from higher, which means I should carry more speed or more di cover more distance, but uh, having the faster run speed as well would be pretty crazy. Subdermal armor, yeah. This menu is a lot nicer. I'm basically at capacity now. So... But the question is, what happens if you go over? I, I suppose you just can't. I can't afford anything anyway, but... Different optics. Okay. Yeah, it's it's quite overwhelming. Also, I like this. I read about this. That looked a little weird, but um, the idea that you actually get up from the the chair, <laughs> amazing, isn't it? There was a mod that did that, uh, and it increased immersion tenfold. And uh, could see they've implemented their own form. Also, you see that the fucking speed. 
how far you can go, how quickly, right? Who needs cars? Worth remembering that a lot of stuff will essentially be the same as before, ultimately. Well, it depends what you mean. Like, gameplay elements? Hell no. <laughs> Everything's very, very different. Um, but, yeah, like, story beats, animations and shit like that. I, I think you're right, yeah. Still can't get over how good the cars sound, man. I haven't... I've seen it, but I haven't got one, so I haven't been able to use it yet. But, uh, that's gonna be the plan, because I'm not gonna go for a hacking build. of R8 and Hurricane in it. Really? It sounds like... Well, in the sense of it, it sounds like a V10, sure. <laughs> uh, right. Um, I can't go and do the afterlife thing yet. I've got no money! We need to check on Barry. We can do the shooting range thing while we're there. Why not? Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Um... Falls about sport. Wish it drove this well, Bailey. Oh shit! The driving does feel slightly improved as well, to be honest. Doors open. That's that's reassuring. Let's go check on Barry. Barry. Oh no! What? Barry, you fucking asshole! I'm sorry. Okay. What? Okay, maybe this is also why they recommend you start. A deep... Oh no! No, no, that is on me. That is on me. I think it's because I waited a day or two while I was out in the city. I should have gone straight back and done it. Runs dead. No, Barry's dead. Um, <laughs> runs fine. Mendez, so it's too late. He can't hear you. Your jeans were fine, Barry. Got another drive. Well, way, nice city, but in that sun rip, Barry. I done goofed. Kitty! Munch on that food. Right, uh, let's check out how uh, hampered the buffs are. I assume the buffs have even been reduced in effectiveness or length, so let's find out. We'll have an hour nap, then we'll take a shower and we'll have a look.
short shower known to man, this. <coughs> oh wait, never mind. Oh my god, they fixed the textures! They actually fixed the textures! It doesn't look broken as fuck anymore! My god! That's the best feature right there. Um, an hour long still- okay, yeah, they've halved the amount of XP you gain for skill XP and the health regen thing as well, fair enough. Oh, they fixed the sideways in the bed thing, like, immediately. They fixed that, like, nearly two years ago. Well, maybe closer to a year. There's one scripting scene where he does still sleep on his side, and that's when you first get back after the chip hole scenario. But yeah, that, that always triggered me. Sleeping <laughs> at a weird angle. Oh, they've changed the look of the Dying Knight pistol as well. Actually, it looks quite unique. that blade mod all right yoinkers don't mind if i do yeah, some of the preview icons look a bit different to me like they've rebuilt the previews like these look way more colorful Okay, so more weapon mods as well, that's neat. Right. I'm gonna put the katana away for a bit. At least that specific one. I think we should go and do this shooting challenge and then sell some weapons and that. Oh look! Naked! Wait. That's weird. So when I selected them it remembered, but it's reset them. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Get the look. These do just look brighter in general. Eh? Yeah, look at that. The, the the boots going really well there. Oh, better yet. Man, I do not fill these. Well, in real life I might, but my, my very ripped character in game. I say very ripped. My somewhat ripped character in game. Does not fit the cup. Big sad. It's just not looking loud enough, really. I think we've got to have the loud t-shirt. It's, it's the cyberpunk way. <laughs> oh my god. And the, and the gold rim glasses. Yeah, my boy. <laughs> Looks so fucking stupid. What a douche. Alright, that'll do. Now I look like I belong. For better or for worse. Alright, let's get this shooting thing done. I can sell the weapons here, actually, but... What weapon shall I use? This thing... Is, uh... It's got less headshot damage multiplier, though. Armor penetration's up. Let's just try it out. Fuck okay. it. I 
I'm going to get used to that not being the crafting tab. Uh, uh, wrong button. I wouldn't mind having one still, so... Ah, uh, this thing. Power assault rifle. Really high... DPS. Oh, that's a double barrel shotgun comparison, though. Uh, still looks like the uh, attack speed's high. I wouldn't mind a slower speed single shot one but let's try that i don't think i've used this tech revolver huh uh Can't really test it in here though, unfortunately. <laughs> well, I guess I could. One second. <laughs> Recoil is insane. I know there's a lot of like cybernex to help. Improve recoil control. Man, man cannot defend himself on the ground. I was trying to get a finisher in on him, so... I, I do want to see the finisher, though, so I might do that real quick. Yeah, that gun, I'm not so sure I want that AR. It's not going to be useful at range, because it's so low damage per shot, high fire rate. Oh, there we go. Fuck them up. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's a cop over there. <laughs> This thing. We playing fucking hide. Go, go, go. What? It wouldn't let me do the finisher. It's alright, as soon as I die again. Oh. Right, anyway. <laughs> I'm done massacring innocent people though.
Update 2.0, I'm loving it so far, but I've barely scratched the surface. So much has changed that it's going to take a lot, tens and tens of hours to, to really feel the full extent of it. Underlying, underlying core mechanics, you know, they're, they're just different. Which is great. I haven't really seen the effect of much of the new police yet, no. Um, quite low level though, so... Might wait a while to really piss off the cops. About to start. You, uh, you got to take a piss or something? Uh, now's the time. Thanks for your concern. Let's start this rodeo. <laughs> Can't just yet. Not till you get in the range. Go on, set up, chop chop. Yeah, I. Thank you. I didn't start fresh today. No. Um, I'm a bit torn on what to do in that regard. Cause I started. A new playthrough a few days ago, or like less than a week ago, and I've been streaming it all. And I think I would have benefited from starting it again, but I think it's too late now. Like, I'm just going to keep playing this playthrough on the stream. I think everything will work out. There's a few tutorial things that got repushed towards me, and I figured it out. It just felt a bit clunky because they weren't coming to me when they should, if that makes sense. Um, just sort of dealing with a lot of things all at once, especially with tutorials to the um uh to like the cyberware and shit like that but um either way i will do another playthrough off stream as well no doubt because i can guarantee even with as much as i'm going to be streaming this i'll probably want to play it more and uh if i'm going to stream it all i i'd rather keep the stream playthrough <laughs> for the stream i should never play past the end of the prologue so did i ever really start um, so like, you know, when you first go to Vic and get your Kiroshis and everything, that would be part of the tutorial for the new cyberware. That's basically changed how that process of selecting the uh, cyberware. So if you've already passed that, you're going to have a weird moment where when you go to a Ripper dock, they're just going to, you're not going to be able to pick what you want. You're going to be forced to select a few items first. Like you're in that tutorial. But um other than that, I'm not I'm not sure. It should be fine. I get why they want people to start new games is because the rebalancing of the economy, the loot and the and uh, like ammo and things like that. It's it's all different. How much money you get paid per per gig or qu like uh, mission now is different as well. So um Continuing on from a already existing save means that things could be a little peculiar in that regard. Like, they'll all be working as intended from that moment on after you update. It's just, um, you know, what you've already accrued might be a bit offset or whatever. Whatever. I think it's fine. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use a, uh, a blade. The range. Alrighty, how many we got? Just six? God damn. Well, no point crying about it. <clears throat> Rules are simple, right? There's the target, shoot it. Don't matter which one, go on and shoot your neighbors. Most hits wins. Uh, meaning hits on the target, not your neighbor. Oh, right. Uh, small caliber iron only. Don't go showing off with your fucking assault bangers or no rocket pukers. Got me? First prize is a pistol. But, uh, a, a real nice one. It's fucking nice, I'm telling you. Anyway, uh, enough words. Get worked up. Ready? 
Hang on. This isn't going to work. <laughs> Three, two, hey, hey, the hell's that? The hell are you doing with that double barrel? Said small caliber only. Uh, forgot my iron. Must be in my other jacket. And that's where you keep your gun in a holster. A holster! Get the fuck out of my sight now! Fuck, Chun. Chill. I'm going. <laughs> Pearls before swine, for fuck's sake. All right. Three, two, one. Punks, learn to shoot! Out of my sight! Now! Well, he's nice, isn't he? Um, okay, what's the pistol? And 1,200. Thanks, Wilson. Sure is oh, pretty. hang on. Uh-huh. Yeah. This looks like the pistol... So this was Dying Light originally, so they repurposed the skin of that initial unique pistol that's yours into this one. That's very confusing. Whatever. Hey, you okay? Something wrong? <sighs> Ain't a damn thing that's right. Contest didn't do shit. Didn't sell a goddamn thing. Nothing. Should try not call them potential buyers Bush League. Yeah. Fuck! A gun's something you gotta respect. You don't know how to shoot, don't do it! Take care, V. See you around. He's right. There is Dying Light. Or is it Dying Knight? I can't remember what the name of the gun is. I think it's Dying Knight. Um, the, that pistol has been reskinned. It still exists. Like, I'll go back to the apartment real quick and show you, but, uh, it's, it's interesting. Man, dashing around like that is really fun. Uh, this is what Dying Night looks like now. It's got a little fucking blade on the end of it, so you can stab someone with it. <laughs> it's still a Lexington by design, but it actually looks quite unique now, I guess. Also, finally having the item previewer in-game is nice. But, uh, yeah. Uh, that threw me off at first. I was like, what the fuck's this gun? And then it says the name, and I'm like, oh, yeah. Okay, um... More weapons are iconic now, as well. Like, I don't think that weapon was initially iconic. But... It is now. Don't... That either, but I'm only gonna stash iconics or sell everything else that I don't want. became trapped. 
But thanks to their Suze Lake 2 hibernation implants, the miners were able to survive without access to food and fresh water for two weeks. My Such God. Day after their rescue and following a brief rest for technical evaluation, the miners were able to immediately return to work. Moving from below the Earth to above it, Militech has announced plans to establish a new colony on the Red Planet. Cow's still here. The first base will be subdivided into three areas, industrial, scientific, and residential. I've been following a, um, a YouTube series of somebody building a replica of this car in real life. And uh, it, it's quite entertaining to watch the new chapters as they come out because they're clearly doing it on a budget. But it's uh, it's um, it's still like really crazy how good of a job they've done. Uh, right, so I think we should. Oh, I don't know what I think we should. I think we should do some more jobs of some description. There's all these NCPD hustles, but I don't think I'm going to bother with those for now. Let's just do gigs within Watson, so we can level up that way. Whoa. Minimap is better as well. I'm noticing it's far more zoomed out. This is the second time they've tweaked that. The first time I thought it's still not far out enough when you're driving at speed. But now you can actually see what you need to see. Which is great. Oh, the engine they're using is like, like I say, it's on a budget, so it's more about the aesthetic of the car, it's not about the, the running gear. It, like I said, it's, it's done in someone's garage on a budget, it's, it's probably like a four cylinder or something inside it, but they, it looks really neat. Oh shit. Um, nothing, you saw nothing. <laughs> Miss click. Oh, I can't. I'm a fucking. Ah. Hey, move your asses. They're dead. I'm good. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm not dead, but I should be dead. Okay, so there are these things still. The skills. I, I completely missed where they are. I thought they had deleted them all. So maybe the level 60 cap is already in effect then. These only went up to 20 before, actually, so... I don't know, this, this is confusing. But it's cool. Yeah, they're not directly tied to any abilities anymore. And for context, I am playing on very hard. Um, yeah, shotguns I've always found have been quite strong, and it seems like they still are, which is good. 
You don't need those anymore. You don't need those anymore. You don't need those anymore. What are you gonna do with them? God damn it. The ability of it is insane. I don't, who needs a car? That's <laughs> insane. <laughs> BG3, Baldur's Gate 3? Uh, I, I haven't played it in a little while, but I, I have been playing it. I, I really, really have, have enjoyed that game so far. I just miss playing it co-op, you know? Hang on. I didn't put it back in the slot. That will do it. But yeah, I, I love Baldur's Gate 3. That game's mega. Just, I don't know, I think I prefer playing it co-op. Also, I've got so many games on the go now, I did start a playthrough on stream, which meant that I stopped my non-stream playthrough, and then because I haven't either had the time because of other games I've been playing, you know, driving stuff, that I just haven't had the chance. Now that this is out, I sure as shit won't be playing it until I'm completed this playthrough to 100% probably um and then I'm going to be playing this more off stream as well so fuck knows <laughs> eventually I'll get back to it probably it's a very new style of game to me having absolute but same here chap like I I never thought I'd really be in at that game but uh well that sort of game but yeah I really dig it Ugh, got stuck. Go on, I got you. Coming around the side. Oh, that's nice mobility. Why are the cops after me? Fuck off! I just covered Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh. NCDD, motherfuckers. Oh. Quick. I'm not part of the gang. Okay, I lost the cops because of that. Nice. I know. You're Lucy Thackeray. Uh, Tex blacked out again. Piece of shit. And you are? V. Your brother sent me to get you out of here. Bertie? Okay. Okay, just a moment. What's with him? Any second now more of those Borg freaks could show. They shot him. Almost got him sorted out, but the bleeding started again. That dialogue tree sounded slightly different. Look, we don't have time for this. The tech they've got in here belongs in a scrapyard. We got a Delta now. Since you're still here, run a scan on him. The pressure's falling. Same with the temperature. He's going into shock. I'll try to stem the bleeding. You, give him a unit of synth blood. Come on! It's on the table. First from the left. Just not in my hand. <sighs> okay. Gotta wait a bit before it closes up. Just finish up already. All right.
right. The crisis averted. Looks like. Rest he'll just have to sleep off. Thanks. Now we can go. Mm. Keep close to me, head down. Love the music in that scene. Sounds different from how I remember it, but it might just be because I'm hyper aware of everything. Come on, just a little farther. Oh yeah, here we go. So there's only one, it seems. Okay, you get two. Um. Why not both? Yeah, yeah, chap, for sure, man. Uh, <laughs> I like a lot of the lingo in this game. Some of it's a bit goofy sounding like choom, but <laughs> doubting the fuck out is is a good one. Yeah, ch choom just sounds a bit like goofy to me, I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Ah, he'll be fine. Oh, I can't do that one. Sad. I can do this one, though. In we go. Get the fuck out. You ride, get in. <laughs> in you go. <laughs> I'm going to chase after him, all right? Go on. Well, this isn't very difficult. Really not going anywhere anytime soon, are you? Hey, Lucy's safe. Cream work. Thanks. Sweet. Going for a ride. Did a pretty good job making up words for a future dialect, but yes, stream sounds a bit weird even. Sometimes. Yeah, so like, I've read the, the original source material playbook for the board game, and, um, like, the, all the language was there from the get-go. Fixes, um, you know, all, anything that's in the game was already there, uh, which is cool uh, that they've, like, used it all to the fullest extent. Dashes do not cost stamina. I do like the sound of that. Also, it's free to refund. It's easy to respec, basically, which is awesome. Whoop! Eep, apple. Okay, so only above 33% stamina will it go where you're aiming. It's kind of hard to keep track of your stamina and everything in the middle of combat, though, I'll be honest.
Yeah, I called it a board game earlier on. Tabletop was a way better way of describing it. I never play those kind of games, to be honest, so... Um... Not too experienced with them, but I did read through it recently. Oh, excuse me. I had to sneeze. Got to the mute button just in time. Nobody wants to hear me go... Blech! Right. I should start spending points, uh... In here. God, I need more skill points, damn it! Um... Well, hang on. Whole one percent prem savings. Where is skill progression? Now I suppose these aren't tied to any section now. I don't know, maybe they are. Headhunter is at eleven. So I assume that's reflexes then. I don't know. Actually, no. I did reset my attributes though, but some of those should definitely be at three still if they are tied to skills. So I think, or attributes, sorry. So I think we are actually getting the result that I was hoping for, which is they aren't tied to those things anymore and you can just level them indefinitely. Oh, off we go. Oh, he's picking up the pace now. Let's go! Hi, oh, Silver! Oh, <laughs> I thought that was going to be really smooth, and I was just going to land back on top and be fine, but I went too far and just got ran over. <laughs> right, let's, um... Let's go do this one. Where's the car? Here it is. That was well better damped. Well better damped, Drov. That was. Well better. Cars bounce a bit weird before. They feel a lot better now. They're still a bit bouncy. But, um, and maybe it is just placebo. I don't know, sometimes they they still move interestingly. Now, it definitely does feel different. Definitely feels different. Over the bumps. Sometimes you just get pinged in a funny way. You're fucked now! Fuck! Oh, not like this! Uh oh, I'm gonna die. That's kinda close. The the pace of it in combat with melee weapons is starting to feel more like fucking Doom Eternal than it is Cyberpunk now. Not that the combat couldn't be fast before, but goddamn! Now it's fast. Real fast. Off with your head! They deserve it, Chad. Don't worry about it. Trust me, they, they earn they earn it. Oh, this one. Well, it's just well I got the double jump already. Because I can make this job very short. Hey, V. How's things? Still alive? Hope so, because I got a new gig. You got a clever recording of a mel- Oh. No. Ah! Ow. Ah! Ah! 
Other side, other side. See, there was a use for that there. Oh! So we could just skip the whole mission. <laughs> Done. Pleasure doing biz with you, V. Your work shows. Uh, Eddie's out. I'll show for it too. Okay, right. Let's. We'll have more jobs soon. I don't think they've. Oh no, they, there's another one up here. Let's go. Also, I want to try another vehicle. Uh, let's try the bike. Hopefully, the bikes ride a little bit. Oh, there's three different external camera shots now on bikes, really close, which is nice. We can get really far. on the map. Oh, oh dear. Um. <laughs> oh my god, that poor soul. That guy was doing nothing wrong. All units in the area, order has been restored. All units instructed to return to patrol. Yes, order restored. Oh, they've already replaced him. There's a blood smear where the other guy was left and they've already replaced <laughs> What you got? Please, I need to be alone. Uh, I'd like to buy some iron. So buy some. Man, what the fuck's this guy's problem? Grumpy shit. See, I'm already up to like 40k eddies. That's awesome. Um, now buying stuff doesn't feel so... such a waste of, of money. Sniper rifle, though. Oh! Ammo containers are a different design now. Uh, apparently you can carry way more ammo and find way more ammo in the world now as well, which is appreciated. Uh, spine tickler. 10% chance to cause an EMP blast when shooting an enemy with a fully charged weapon. It's uh, interesting. I'm not sure really anything here stands out to me. These double barrels are usually pretty insane, so maybe I'll take that one. Like, 132, 187, yeah, let's take that. Or I can get the crafting spec for it. Yeah, let's just do that. Craft one. I already had this one though. Is this a smart? Yeah, smart one. Don't. Yeah, that one then. Put that on there. So can I? 
Can I upgrade shit now? Like, why can't I upgrade any of the weapons I've got equipped right now? That's what I want to know. Is it because they weren't crafted? I don't quite understand how that works now. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. There's no DPS value anymore either, which is kind of frustrating. I guess that value was a bit busted before as well, to be fair. But, uh, well, I've got two very slow weapons. One that I can use for range, one I can use up close, and then... Melee, I guess. So... That says... 34.49 damage per hit. What if I was to craft a new one? It's the same. This is... Interesting then. So it's tied to tier, I guess. Like, let's have a look at the double barrel. They should all be the same level though when you craft them, so the fact that the katana doesn't need I whatever. Whatever. I'll know if it's busted because I will die very quickly in combat. Look at this guy go. Uh, live around here? <laughs> Sorry, that's the the voices in my head telling me. <laughs> this is why you have quick save. <laughs> the frame he was just standing there. <laughs> Alright, anyway. This child killer is to get your hands on the original BD that recorded the whole thing. Yeah, you heard that right, unfortunately. More info attached. I think I'm just gonna go in loud. Um, that's not what I pressed. There we go. Yeah, so this one's a bit fucked up. Um, to those of you who may recall, Near the beginning of the game, we were coming up the elevator into the apartment complex, and there was a bit on TV. And uh, I'm assuming it's the guy, but there was a, a, I think it was a priest on there, or whoever. Um, it's his son, who was, I think, kidnapped and killed, and they recorded it, and they, they edit those sorts of videos and then sell them onto the black market, and, that. and that's what we're looking for, the source of right now. So yeah. Everyone here deserves to die, is, is my justification, basically, so... Right. Daddy and his dolls. Oh my god, he lost his arm! Trying to get me killed! Trying to get you killed, what do you think? I'm so glad you can manually trigger those finishes now, with the skill. That's awesome. The bitch out! Oh my god, they are just chilling out there, aren't they? Yeah, nice. Oh god. Oh, that was... <laughs> the fucking mobility, I love it. You can close the gap between you and someone else so quickly. And as a result, melee sounds... It's a fun thing to play now. Before, you just have to tank loads of bullets. 
and use as much cover on the way, but... And I... This isn't even my final form yet. We can go even more insane. No doubt. I meant to turn it off, but miscloaked. Oh, that guy is. Yeah, he's. He's not coming back, is he? Before he gets. What do you think? Else it'll feel like stabbing a pillow. Okay. Uh, pulling up by one frame. Augmenting pain feedback and ferrous aftertaste. Freddy boy, you're a natural. Uh, cutting that sweat stench. No, no, leave it. Some go for that extra kick. Put out two cuts. Sweat in, sweat out. <laughs> hey, good thinking, Papa. What a fucked up little thing they've got going on here, eh? Wakey, wakey, gentlemen. What, what, what's happening? Security! Too far away to hear us. Well, let's not do anything rash here. We just tune and sell. We don't scroll. Honest to God. We can figure this out. Just tell us what you want, and we'll make it happen. Got a little family affair going here, huh? People want to buy, so we sell. Business is business. Looking for something in particular? You know, if, if it wasn't us, there'd be someone else. You, you, you want to see something really hard for? Freddy! We just supply what Night City demands. That's all. XPD of a preacher's little boy. Murdered. Ring any bells? Uh, which preacher? I just got a fresh batch with boys. No clue who their daddies are. They're gonna need more. Bryce Stone, circuit rider on News 54. Son was Bobby Stone, 12 years old when he died. Are we talking black, white, Chicano? Any identifying marks? Style of execution? Papa? I think I know the one he wants. BD-9430. Preacher's boy, who murdered him? Who gave you the XPD? Nobody gives us anything. They they leave dead drops. It's Preacher's a lie. Boy, pick him up. It's not true. Keeps things secure for everyone. This guy's got a bit of a background. You got it. Must have noticed something in the background, some kind of clue. Reflection in the mirror, tattoo, anything. Or our, our only concern is with imperfections, N not who makes them. Kindly hand it the fuck over. Now. All right, please, just relax. Just take it. Freddy! Sir, it's just behind us on the shelf. BD-9430. Oh, shit. That's it. That's the one. Just, just take it. <sighs> Freddy, no! Freddy, I 
Henrik, answer me right now. He's not going to be able to do that. For My only boy, stay with me. Don't do this. Don't make me do this. Oh my God. It's fucking evil, but, uh, you know. Probably should have just killed the dad, really, but... I don't know, I wanted him to despair <laughs> before he took it to the back of the head. Oh. Shit's so satisfying. Oh, nice leg. Shoot the wing mirror off, nice. The ricocheting bullets off the blade there were, were pretty fun. Why, why, why did I get in this? I don't want this. Where's my bike? It's over the way down here, isn't it? Whoa, I've took it. Yes, I. These are... Uh, that's a tier 2 plus, actually, so it's slightly higher. We'll, we'll equip that one instead. Sniper could be useful. I'd be sticking to the shotgun I've got, though. Hmm. Let's get rid of it for now. I'm assuming these are now just going to be accessible from um <sighs> from the wardrobe. Hi Jan. Good to see you. Great work, B. Let's hope it helps trace the motherfucker who scrolled the thing. Gig's closed. All right, chat. I'm going to take a really small break here. I'll just be a couple of minutes and uh, we'll get back to it. Uh, I think we're going to do... I think I'm going to aim to just do all the gigs in Watson. And then once we're done with that, we can just move on because I'll have leveled up a decent amount by then. But yeah. Back in a few minutes.
All right, I'm back. Uh, it just came to my mind while I was on break. And I always forget to ask this of people, but uh, if you're enjoying the stream, appreciate it if you give it a like. Algorithms, baby. I don't know if it does anything, but it can never hurt to ask. And if you don't like it, well, shit, give it a thumbs down. Not that the thumbs down really does quite as much these days. Well, maybe it does, who knows. But yeah. Appreciate you watching, basically. Thanks for hanging out. I know a lot of people will be very keen to play it themselves. Uh, maybe not this so much as um, Phantom Libby, because new story elements, but uh, yeah. I don't really give a shit. These streams could be empty and I'm still going to just play it and stream it, because if the game runs and the stream doesn't suffer from it, I'll... I'm going to be playing it anyway, right? So... Okay... So the next job would be... This one down here. Let's do a little fast travel action. Yeah, you're right, Red. I, to be fair, most of my streams, even back on Twitch, were like that with these sorts of games. It's, it's chat. There's not much chat going on. It's always nicer to have chat going on, but like, at the same time... Yeah. People can do what they're going to do, you know? So long as it's being enjoyed, I don't really mind. I'm going to ramble to myself anyway. I don't do that off stream for those curious. <laughs> I, I don't quite talk to myself while playing the games. Whee! Pete, got a rat problem on my block. Who doesn't, right? Thing is, these rats are human sized. Look just like tiger claws, too. Biggest one is a certain Taki Kenmochi. So do your fixer a solid and neutralize her ass, will ya? Deeds attached. Alright. Ah, you. Okay. Sop, what are you selling? You're just standing at a window. How do I get in there? What happens if I hack this right in front of everyone though? Well, it's not even this, it's this. Yeah, okay, they don't like it. I thought that might happen. It's a bit of an overreaction though, guys, come on. Seven A, one C, one C, B. Okay. The double. Oh shit. Oh. God, you're a bit strong. Oh. oh wait, hang on. It's un I didn't equip my new pistol, did I? Uh oh. Yeah, they got me. New death animations. Neat. 
They're stronger than I was expecting. Oof. I've just gone in with the pistol. I don't think the, uh, the shotgun's doing as much work as I was hoping it would. Now uh, we got to do this again. Oh well. Oh, sweet. That worked out. Let's re equip it actually before I forget again. That makes them more susceptible to finishers, neat. Six, oh, six seconds of... Yeah, really just need to level into this a bunch, I think. Hundred percent finisher range. I don't know how close you really need to be. Maybe assault rifles and SMGs are the way to go. Assault rifles, SMGs, blades. Right? Assault rifles use rifle ammo. Submachine guns use pistol ammo now. So you've got that diversity in your build. And you've also... I would probably go... Um, low fire rate. AR, it's more like a DMR or something with a single shot semi-auto sort of deal uh, and then have like a high fire rate um, SMG or something to use as, as backup. Yeah, that could be good. i would go for that for now though. Keep going in a body. Why not? Hello, I'm cornered. Oh no, you don't. Jesus Christ, dude. Excuse me? <laughs> oh, I'm coming in for the finisher. Oh! Hmm, money shards. Nice.
The water fountain on the fritz. All right. That's what it's all about. One less tiger in this town. Appreciate your problem solving skills, V. Get closed. We're leveling well. We have the awu and the meow, yeah. <laughs> What's next? We're gonna get like a morph. <laughs> Annoyingly, it switched out uh, my weapon as well. New katana, though. Slightly more powerful. The way weapon upgrading works is confusing. Like, it's done on tiers now, so it's tied to the... Yeah, I'm... I'm gonna have to do some reading after the stream today to understand exactly what they've done. I need to get edge runner really so I can use more like my capacity's gone up but edge runner will help me oh edge runner's all the way up there Jesus fuck so I need technical ability anyway hmm I think that is one actually red so uh, you, I think you're right yeah Okay. I have more slots. Neat. All right, Red, catch it in a minute. Seven A seven A five five B D E Z. So the inhalers just recharge now, so there's no consumption of them. So I might as well go to a... A proper dock. And get myself... How do I get up there? Ah! There you go, that's all. Magic. I'm loving this so much more, this system, though. Actively leveling shit without worrying about what level your attributes are is nice. Constant progression. Who'd have thunk it? <laughs> Bloody hell, I scaled those stairs like a motherfucker, don't I? Killer hey. Does. Oh, cheers, bro. Had any nice threads for me? If thrift falls into your definition of nice, then sure. Alright, what called duds? None of it. It all looks hot. No, some of it looks alright. It mostly looks horrible though, so yeah. Sorry, mate. I need to change my style. 
need to change my style. Hmm? Don't we just get naked in the middle of the street, don't mind me. Oh, look at that. Fancy schmancy. I don't really have any smart pants to go with it though. Or shoes. Hmm. Fucking high viz, bud. Yeah. Fashionable armor. I don't know. I don't know if it's really. Scream it out to me, bro. And that, that jacket looks comfy. I want that jacket. The size. The size of it. The good thing is it does automatically just slap everything in this pool though. Once you find a new item, so you don't have to own it for very long. Yeah. Whatever. Wrong button. I wonder how long it will take me to get there on foot. It's half a kilometer. Ah! Uh, oh! I'm saving. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, no! Oh god! It's kind of working. Oh. It's fucking hell. This is insane. Uh oh. Ah! Oh. <laughs> it's fine. Man, <laughs> this is fun. Who needs cars? Oh god, get. <laughs> oh, oh no, oh no, I'm dead. Yeah. Oh, the sound of me legs. <laughs> I got carried away. <laughs> Certified yeet that one. Ah, oh, I went so far. Oh, you know I'm doing it again, right? I didn't make it on top, that's fine. Synthetic meat, you're in for Oh no! Oh. <laughs> Did it again. Not dead this time. Elevator. some hospitality get to know our unexpected guest go to the port in kabuki pop a gps on our comrades ride car came with him all the way from the ussr more info attached nobody you ask me it's all another one of them weird ad campaigns ad campaign 
Oh. Yeah, that is the only annoying thing, is that crouch and dash are on the same button now. So it's very easy for me to accidentally do it. Let's see if I can adjust that. Left control. Yeah, there it is. Well, I don't really need a dedicated button for it. I can just double tap the direction. So... I just delete it? No, oh, well, I can make it delete key. What about alt? Do I have alt set to anything? Cyberware systems. Wait, what? Oh, I think that's like... Usable systems. Well, I don't have any of those just yet, so I'm probably just gonna... I'm gonna use it as alt for now. Because that rests well where my hand is. Oh dear. It's fine. If she goes the other way, I'm gonna try and hack that. Might get seen though, so... Job complete. Perfect. Silent and effective, just like in the movies. Except we don't make that sort of scratch, but can't have everything, right? Gig club. Host. Whoa. It's another level up. Level up. Okay. Uh. Oh, it's, uh, what's the name from, from Edge Runners? Rebecca. <laughs> I just noticed a little picture. That reminds me, you can go and get a shotgun in a bit, actually. Oh, and look how much money we've got! 62k! God damn! God damn. Oh my god, did you see how far she went? Watch this. Yeet! <laughs> God damn. That's pretty good.
Let's put in the body a little bit, shall we? Adrenaline rush is going to be a good shout, I think, for uh, for the kind of build I'm on. More health, and more regen. Adrenaline rush mode. Adrenaline rush. Uh, in addition to their base effects, blood pump, cyberware, and health items now also give adrenaline equal to 30% max health, up to a max of 50% max health. Adrenaline is indicated by a yellow bar and acts like extra health by absorbing damage. It also decays over time. Adrenaline Rush will remain active as long as you have adrenaline available. Okay. Then these can affect Adrenaline Rush. Yeah, because um, cold blood is gone now. Um, I talked about this a bit in one of the last streams as well, when we looked at the build planner and I saw this Adrenaline Rush feature. I was like, oh, this is... This is very cold-blooded, but uh, very much like cold blood, but in a different tree. But I didn't look at all the trees, and as it turns out, cold blood is gone now. So this is the replacement. Uh, or, you know, something similar to it, anyway. Yeah, this is going to be important for melee builds, I think. So you can tank damage. It'd be important for any build where you want to tank damage, but yeah. Got a nice bonus. <laughs> Even this car sounds different. Oh my god, it sounds cool. Sounds like a fart box. Awesome. Don't really need these. Don't really need them. I should keep these actually. They they have a bit more use now. Well, that one certainly doesn't. I could probably uh, go to Ripper Dock again at some point and upgrade some of this stuff. Allows you to aim and perform ranged attacks, sliding, dodging, or dashing. Slows time by 60% for two seconds when you aim a ranged attack during a slide, dodge, or dash. I'm not finding much use out of this because I've, I'm not really dashing around with the guns. I'm dashing around with the melee, so... I think getting rid of that and switching it out for like a sand of stand sort of operating system. Sand of Istan, sand of Istan, I don't know. Sand of Istan sounds like a country, doesn't it? <laughs> the Sandy, there you go, easy. Mitigation grants, yeah, okay. How much? 14 it costs. Okay. Uh, right. More jobs, I guess. Let's get our, um... Our fast car back. Where are the other jobs at, though? Is there a job I'm missing here somewhere?
I can't see it if there is. Maybe I just need to wait. Ah, there it is. Yeah. Literally was set less than a couple of seconds away. Right, I'll go straight to this one. I guess we can do... Now the question is, will they have fixed the infamous bug on this gig? Which is... Will there be a floating invisible... Uh, an invisible shotgun in this man's hands? We're about to find out. Well, after I hack some shit, of course. Careful with that trigger. How did you find me? Future! I'm here by contract from a fixer, nothing personal. Hand over the stolen meds and I'm gone. Stolen? <laughs> the Bale of Barrett. I told you not to move. I'm sorry. Ripper docs. They're the real criminals. Bale of Paradox. For cyber psychosis. Uh, I'm not fucking crazy. Easy, easy. Shut up. Go away. If they're no use to you, they don't work. Just hand them over. You're the same as them. Rippers, politicians. The same as that fucking halt. I could think of a few different. Shut up. That bastard he stole from. From research. He doesn't care about the sick. But soon, I'll find him. End him. A Militech HKS-47 with polymer reinforcement. You were a soldier. Militech, 3rd Light Division, 155th Infantry Regiment. Seven years in a fucking jungle. When times were simpler... Before you got sick. You cast me out like a dead battery. That's no reason to become a terrorist. Where'd you serve? Brazil. Remember all of it. Dirt on my face. F fatigues always. Always wet. It's like a brain dance. I, I, I can't shut off. The memories flood back. Without the adrenaline. Without my brothers. Fuck. So quickly they forgot me. You're angry, and I get it. You feel cheated. Not just me! I know, but if you zero Holt, you'll make it worse for everyone in your condition. They'll hunt you down. Leave. Go, please. No, I can't without those meds. 
Over there. I want to be alone. It's interesting they put the boss health on the top of the screen. Poor son of a bitch. Jeez. You know Cyberpsych's a death sentence. We can't help him. Maybe you can't. But Arasaka, Militech, Biotechnica, Kang Tao? Should I go on? I guess they don't see the profit in it. Maybe this murder Holt idea is not so bad. At least it'd piss a few people off. Sure, I guess, but what's the point? Better than burying your head in the sand. I missed. Well, his health is still at the top of the screen, so that's a bug, I think. Um, I guess once I deposit and end the job, it'll figure it out. Try this out on the controller again for the driving at some point. I can probably do it now actually, but I'm so used to driving on the keyboard again now. It's just hassle <laughs> picking up and dropping the controller each time. Especially given that you can now shoot from the car, right? I guess it depends on the scenario. I might switch to this. It's only slightly less damage per shot. Better headshot. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with that. That does actually give you a... Minus 50% accuracy, holy fucking shit. <laughs> it's a lot, it's a, it's a lot of tequila, I guess. <laughs> Drawing the weapon automatically refills its ammo up to 15%. Um, what's 15% of 6, chat? Because, uh... <laughs> if it's rounding down, then you might be alright, but uh, up to 15% wouldn't even account for one round, I think. <laughs> so... <laughs> that doesn't sound very useful. Five seconds after drawing your weapon, gain... 10% crit chance, minus 50% bullet spread, and plus 20% weapon swap speed. 
It's, it's point nine. Yeah, exactly. So <laughs> up to point nine of a bullet. Awesome. That's quite neat. There's like stacking eminence, uh, uh, elements, eminence. I can't even speak today. Wow. I don't think I've ever said eminence <laughs> in my life. Oh, it's it's definitely the tiredness. Um, yeah, I'm putting that on. What? What do you mean it's already full? That wasn't a thing before. So you can't just replace it anymore like you could before? That's... interesting. I, I guess it makes sense, but also like... Damn, that sucks. I'm gonna have to stick with my point nine of a round. Yeah, that, that blows. Used to be able to take... No, I don't think you ever could take these off, actually. Oh, that sucks. Well... It's got a sight on it. Can you change the sight? Surely you can change the sight still. Yeah, okay. I'm glad that they've changed the wording on these. Having it a plus percentage on the range. An additional zoom, that helps. 20% and 0.5. Yeah, they're all very much... Because they were very random before. Like, you could have the exact same sight and they'd be slightly different. Very odd. Thanks, V. Couldn't have been easy, but you handled it like a pro. Job done, contract closed. She didn't even know the half of it. She wouldn't be glad to hear about what happened, really, given she's got this whole thing about cyberpsychosis. They will be the very last thing I do in the game. You can quote me on that. Actually, probably not. Because... Finding all the fast travel points. Oh shit. <laughs> ah! Ah! I'm trying to avoid them and... <laughs> That's fucking sick. <laughs> It's the first one of those I've seen. If you can just do a finisher on that. an enemy with a blade when you're behind them in stealth, I might test that theory out. Pretty fucking loud, I feel like. Ooh. 
wait for the ram to recover. It's really slow. Unsurprisingly. From my understanding, that's how it is, Putty Putty, yeah, I, uh, I... It would be nice to be able to remove them, but I guess the idea is... You find the crafting spec, or buy the crafting spec, and then just craft a new version of the weapon, right? And then it'll be up to the best of your... Because, like, crafting is tied to... Your level, is it? No, because you, you can just craft a legendary if you have the components. I guess maybe it is just tied to the uh, spec, you know, the crafting spec. So you have to find them of higher tiers, which kind of sucks. Some of it I'm not so sure about, you know. Having more control over the crafting would be nicer. But maybe there's just something I haven't seen yet. Yeah, I don't know. And I'm, it's just so much to get used to. Yeah, I think it's more that the base effect of all of those perks are now just available from the get-go in the new system, so you don't need, like, Edge Runner Artisan or whatever to be able to craft legendaries. You just can craft them. So, like, in that regard, I guess it's nice, because then you can get a bit more build diversity and not always have to build into, uh, in technical ability. You can focus on maybe spreading it around a bit more or f pushing harder into one area. I think it's just going to take some adjusting to the way the new systems work. And, uh, again, I think we're all going to have to just learn through, uh, testing it out. It's the annoying thing about playing it on console, uh, not that I am, but for those that are, so, is you are really hard-coded into your attributes when you you build a character. The, the, there'll always be a mod available that you can just push them back, like redeem them or something. The attributes, which I think would be a nice option to have. Maybe you have to pay for it or something to balance it, but... Yeah. Either way, I'm really loving all the changes so far. At most, I'm sort of on the fence about some of the stuff. Cutting 
It's not like jarringly bad. Ooh, oops. Right. Let's get out of dodge. Oh yeah, I need to go to a dock as well. Can I get up here? I can. Joinkers. I love the new mobility stuff as well. Like, so fun. Recent book in the shade of an apple tree as a treasure of this generation. Grantchester, who is an AI created by Raven Micro Cybernetics, has been lauded for several of her works over the years. Her first novel, Requiem for a Samurai, which was published in 70 languages simultaneously, sold over three million. That's happy, which means I'm happy, which means you get your eddies and everyone's happy. Contract closed. Thanks, V. I'm just a good merc, you know? What can I say? Evidently, I'm not fussy about shooting people in the head because I've done it plenty of times already. I mean, that 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 kid and his dad, they, they deserved it. Those BD sluts. Mid-air maneuverability adjustment. Oh, well, go on then. Go on then. See what it's like. Oh yeah, you can really... Yeah, I don't know, the dash is still... kinda hard to... You can at least avoid jumping to your death probably with this. You know what, actually, I don't think I need that. And that's what I love about this update as well, is you can just be like, boop. Do I want the mitigation though? That's 40% stamina after neutralizing an enemy while dashing. <sighs> I feel like that's a rare thing to happen. Plus 100% mitigation chance from throwing a dash. I think that will probably help me with my health. Shooting while dashing would be neat. But we'll get there. We'll get there. Alright. What else gig wise have we got? Oh, there's another one right here. And I know which one this one is. We're gonna do the forbidden thing. Ugh. Uh, 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 which is drive really badly. That's the forbidden thing. No. Oh no, it's not even the job of the gears. Same. And whatever she's Found investigating, her. it's made her a lot of enemies. You know she do best to cut it out no and catch my drift. Come on, I don't know. This. Okay, look, I know how it sounds, but somebody would have taken this gig anyway, right? I don't know. Maybe there's an angle you can play here. Either way, info's attached. Fine. Fine. Stop! Not one more fucking step! Who put out the hit? Give me a name! Anna, drop this investigation. It's in your best interest. That a threat? I'd remind you, you're the one in the fucking crosshairs. Hey, easy. I just want to help. Help? Phonic implant must be fried. I think you men intimidate. Just to end your investigation. Really pissed off the wrong people. Which people? How long ago was this save? Ah, uh, still in past, uh, it was like four. You know, I'm going back to that. Because 
I just realized if you do that quest after a certain point, that gig after a certain point in the main storyline, then you can see her again later on. And I feel like, fuck it, we can... I, I want to try and go for as many of those sorts of things as I can. So I think that's a sign that I should get back to the main storyline, really. So I think we'll go to the afterlife next. Um... Hundred and ten thousand. Whew. Whew. That's expensive. Yeah, they have, have they made these more expensive? I think they've made them more expensive. I feel like this one was not quite that much either. I think they're just trying to balance it out a bit. Yeah, this is uh This is rebalanced alright. Um, components. That's what I need. So let's go to you. Send me. Um, well, that's, that's a shame. <laughs> There's no collision on it. They've missed that one out. That's right. There's collision up here. There must be. Oh, don't jump too far now. Any new imports in the trash kingdom? Only the finest. Grab them while they're fresh. Oh. He genuinely is just selling trash. He's not selling components. So do I just buy them to... They're so expensive. What the fuck? Okay, well now I'm confused. Is there a way to buy components, or do you just have to buy shit to scrap it? In which case... For real? This is only gonna be for... Oh, buy the whole stack, dude. Just auto-fill me. Oh, that is more expensive than I thought. They're 200 each. Yeah, nah. You can keep that. You can- <laughs> you can keep that. Technical ability, which one was it? It was... Or crafting components from looting. Okay, grenades and health recharge now, got it. Plus 30% health from the final charge of your health item. I thought I had a blood pump. Maybe I've got to reinstall it. That will encourage me to keep moving. <laughs> also, I need to scrap all of this shit.
Yeah, these aren't worth buying to scrap, that's for sure. Maybe I have to buy components from elsewhere now. Junk stores have no purpose now. Awesome. I didn't see any in the weapons store either, though. So, how many do I have? I can't even see them. What do they look like? Have they changed? Maybe they just don't appear in your inventory anymore. They're on the left here. I'm an idiot. But yeah, I don't have many. I think they've slimmed down the types of components as well. Before there was two types of each level, each, like each tier. Now there's just one of each. No tier one component quick hack stuff. That's always been like that though, I think. Well, now what? Should we stop by a different store? Oh, there's none close by. What about Ripper Doc? Who is this Ripper Dog? I've never been to this Ripper Dog. Is he new? Who the fuck are you? Wait, hang on. What's word around Kabuki? Any juicy deeds? No, I've never been here. Ho ho! Are there? While back. Some badges rolled in. Thought they were gonna sweep the place. Check my permit. Turns out, they were looking for some Soviet spy. <laughs> How's that for drama? Wonder what those Ruskies are up to. Looking to get shipped. Glad to hear it. Let's get you set up. He didn't have anything to trade, though. How peculiar. Arms. Yeah, like, this is interesting. So cyber arms or all, like, all arms attachment stuff are now... Before you had the different types. You had mantis blades, gorilla arms, uh, you had the mono wire, and, and you had the projectile launch system. And then you could get attachments that changed the type of damage effect they did. You know, from, like, uh, electricity to physical to fire you know so they were quite modifiable but now the unit itself is baked in with that damage effect so you have to spend like 15 grand a piece <laughs> just to get the other one in which is interesting I should get Mantis blades. The idea that they only add plus eight <laughs> is a bit insane to me. I think we're going to get some man explodes. I never use man explodes. So let's start using them. Yeah, 
I need to start thinking about my capacity, really. Capacity can go insanely high, can't it? I suppose it's tied to level as well. I almost don't want this. I think I'm just going to sell this. Karenza. Uh, well, I'll hold on a bit. Just in case. No point selling it. It's not worth fuck all. What's this? Atomic sensors. Increased movement speed proportional to the enemy's detection of you outside of combat. Maximum plus 29% movement speed at 80% detection. This effect ends when you're in the combat. That's interesting. Successful takedowns grant 12.5% headshot damage, 6% movement speed. What's considered a takedown? Just a kill? Is headshot damage a thing with melee weapons? <laughs> These are the questions I must ask. It's kind of neat. Leave it for now. Mitigation's always worth having. We got one of those, so... Most of an attacking enemy is the less damage they deal to you. Minus 11% incoming damage at 3 meters. Damage reduction tapers off to 0% at 6 meters. Okay. And gives you some armor as well. That's 35% mitigation chance for 4 seconds if you lose 35% of health within 3 seconds. The numbers, Mason, what do they mean? There's so many numbers. Plus 20% armor effectiveness when attacked from the side or rear. So just show them your butt and you'll be fine. Range guard. Plus 45% armor. Uh, not 45%. Just plus 45 armor. There are no enemies within 6 meters. Well, that's probably never going to happen, so... Uh, the legs are quite alright as they are, though... They're not expensive, so... I kind of want to see what having... Fortified ankles... Not fortified ankles, the uh, Jenkins' tendons. Just for the increased sprint speed. But it really doesn't sound worth it, because double jump is so versatile. Maybe once you get this thing fully leveled up to tier 5, it'll be insane. And you'll be able to run faster than a car. Hopefully. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Circulatory system. What have we got? Well, I already own two of these, so... Blood pump functions as a powerful health item. Instantly restores 45 health. Regenerates 9 health per second for 6 seconds. Jenks is That's useful. I am very close to capacity. That one will be very useful, though. Upgrade to tier 2 plus. Goes up to 6% health item effectiveness. Ah, uh, why not? I should I should upgrade this a bunch though. Or the legs.
Reflexes attuned. Plus uh, 0.1 crit chance per attribute one. We're maxed out, so that's two. It doesn't really do a whole lot, does it? I got an extra ballistic coprocessor because of the tutorial being forced on me again after I've already done it in 1.63. I got a free 500 and something eddies, guys. Minted. Absolutely minted. Well, the armor is always going to be a good one to upgrade. But I, uh, I don't have the components. I need some blue boys. God damn. It does nothing. It literally does nothing. Changes nothing. What's the point? Unless it's another plus two and plus four on top of that plus two and plus four, but I doubt that. Okay, well, what about this? Oh, that's expensive though, 75. It does up the damage per hit a bit. Oh, go on then. I would like Asunder, please. Where are they? What do I need? I need more sideware capacity. Okay. It's 20. Holy shit. How much is this? 14. I won't even be able to extract data anymore. That's fine. That's fine. When active on the ground, slows time by 30%. Why is it different when you're in the air? Okay, it's stronger in the air, holy shit. That's quite cool. Well, I've got to get one of them, right? This one's... This one's a bit more bland, but... There's not a space between press and two. It's presto! <laughs> presto activate and deactivate. Cooldown is shorter on this one by 10 seconds. But it lasts 2 seconds... ...longer on this one. Okay, right, um... Let's sacrifice some shit, alright? I think we can sacrifice this. And let's try this. Why not? Now we can do this slow down time stuff. Awesome. And look how much money we still have. God damn. Let's just up this. We're out of components we'll see in there. So I'll leave it there.
checking out his new stuff. We don't need a katana anymore. Um. How do I equip these suckers? So Cyber Systems It's what's already on C. Open f uh, isn't it? Um. Oh, I don't know, bro. <laughs> well, I don't need weapon melee anymore, so I could just replace that. I can work with that. Let's try. Will it just override it, or will I have to unequip it elsewhere as well? That would be sad. Okay, that's my... That's the Sandy. So what's the... Key binding for... Is there a hotkey I can have for it? Fist us melee, four. Well, I can't do it in here anyway, shit. <laughs> oh, how do I get out? Sorry, it wasn't me. Please. It's alright. Just chilling. What should I do? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Just got ran over. <laughs> ah! Whoops. Nobody died, ah. it's fine. <laughs> ah. I need to double check. You better target to deal massive damage. To do so, hold and release. He doesn't really leap very far, does he? I was kind of hoping it'd be a bit more than that. I guess when you're sprinting. If I could prime it while I'm sprinting, that'd be great. Okay. Well, at least that means I can still carry three main weapons, so I think having a... Go back. Jesus, lads, calm it down. <laughs> Let's go back to the apartment. Check weapons and everything. a better... Oh, 
is it? A, uh, it's a certain rifle. I can't remember what it's called. But I'll know it when I see it, so. Maybe we'll have the pistol there. That there. And then the rifle will go there. I also need to see where I can get myself some components. Unless you can only find them in the world, in which case, shit. Vehicles more expensive now? They might well be. Not by much, if they are. I don't know if they are, you know. I should probably wait until as late as I can in the game to buy all the vehicles, though. <laughs> because otherwise, it, summoning a vehicle is going to be very awkward. Let's see what you got. What I like to hear. I hope it's components, because I need them. You don't have components. That sucks. How do you find them? Where do you buy them? Can you not buy components anymore? Surely you must be able to. Maybe only that one specific junk vendor wasn't selling them. I'll go check another one. I checked Cyber. Uh, sorry, Ripper Docs, they don't sell anything anymore. They used to sell mods for cyberware, but cyberware mods aren't a thing anymore, I don't think. Oh, piss flaps. Which one was it? <laughs> the rifle I want isn't even here. A whole bunch of shit. It's not too bad. I guess you can just buy weapons and scrap them, but that's 28,000 eddies. <clears throat> 10 grand. God damn. I'm alright, really. SMG. Minus 3% crit chance, but minus 10% spread. Recoil reduction could help. Called direction reduction. That's just recall reduction. Well, that's confusing me now. Minus 3% crit chance plus 12.5% recall reduction. But this one's. literally just 2.5%. That's the difference. Okay. Well, oh, whatever. I guess an SMG is not going to... I don't know. Less effective range. Yeah, why not? I already had one. 
But it wasn't as good. I don't think. <laughs> Whatever, it's done. Let's, let's put it on the gun. Shit, I can't. I need to upgrade. <laughs> no. It's probably just quicker, faster, and out there. Whoa! Uh, let's just let's just start this quest line. Got the eddies. Get it going. And we can start getting friendly with Pad Am. Oh, yeah. Hope you like watching sex scenes on YouTube, chat. Hope I don't get banned for that. That would be sad. Uh, how do I... What is it? I was missing it with this. Keep that in there for now. What now? You call the backup, crack some heads open, drag the bodies. How's the things? Go in. After life's all about rep. Respect to the man. Chap. Hey, a little longer too. Claire. Right? Rip is on the way. You come to talk about my offer? Actually, drop by for something else. No worries. Swing by my garage when you get a minute. Nova, see you there. It's busier in here than hey, it used to be. Yeah, you the whole bar. Just get your drunk butt home, will ya? Yeah. Way more people in here than usual. Know it. I lost everything. Let Prove me be you. plain again. Solve your own problems. Clean up you your own shit. Will? Go fuck yourself. Be careful who you bargain with. Need a fixer. Got something that can't wait. Let him in. Hmm. Not here. Not there. Who are you? Name's V. And what is it you want, V? All these years, it's really her. Fucking bro, just kicking it back on a couch at the afterlife. Don't mess with her, she's got MRI. See right through you. Need your Give service. The truth. Gotta track a guy down. Mm-hmm. Anders Hellman. Hotshot engineer. Worked for Arasaka. Millisec. Anders Hellman. Pinpoint him for me? Huh. Thanks. Jump in too soon. First, my help's got a price. Second and third, Dexter Deshawn, Jackie Wells, t -Buck. Multiple bells ringing, V. Left a lot of bodies behind. Death walks in your wake. Chalk that up to bad luck? There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Socket Tower. How they shot me up right in front of her. Wanna go through obits? Really? Fine. Johnny Silverhand. Zeroed inside our socket tower. Before your very eyes. Got more if you want. Or we could just talk. Got balls on you, boy. Don't like that on everybody, but they seem to suit you. Anyways, feelings be damned, I've always said. This is pure biz. You need my help, so get those eddies ready. Mm-hmm. See? Should be enough. Mm-hmm. Come back tomorrow. We'll talk. Okay. Hey, interested in some work? Doing what? A business opportunity. Cargo transport. Get from A to B, quick and quiet. Interested? I'm listening. 
It's simple. You go to the Kabuki waterfront, collect the package, give me a call, then I tell you how to deliver it. Very straightforward. Yeah, everything except my pay. Don't worry, there's a bonus in it for you. Imported and duty-free. Duty-free and detail-free. Yes, but altogether fair. It's a simple job, generously compensated. Do you accept? Yeah, sure, I'm in. Good, I knew we'd find acceptable terms. Head to the Kabuki waterfront, then search for a fridge with the words, no future. Once you locate it, collect what you find inside, then call me for further instructions. Till then, I guess. Well, I could do more side stuff while I wait. No, I couldn't, because I'm waiting on that one. Yeah, let's just wait. See Rogue, expecting me. Hey Rogue, I'm back. What about Hellman? Two, please. Make some room. Sit down. Hope you found him. Don't see that often. Determination like yours. Must really need this guy. Matter of life and death. <laughs> Haven't heard that for a while either. Bottle stays. Go ahead. Enjoy. To your health. To yours, kid. Gonna need it. Thanks, Nix. Queen of the afterlife. Who would have thunk? Got a shard for you. Intel. Interesting stuff. Think she'll help? The rogue I remember was one cold-ass bitch. But she usually went with her gut. Something tells me she thinks you check out. Let's see what you got. Your helmet's not on any payroll. Not officially, anyway. But he does pop up in GNT's confidential stacks. It's a Kang Tao subsidiary, Chinese Corp. Kang Tao's been using them as a fig leaf for years. They're masked for more sensitive operations. All that clear? Probably keeping him hidden from Arasaka. He must have worked on a top secret project. Mm-hmm. Hidden from Arasaka or any other mega corp that wants what he knows. Decrypted map of upcoming Kang Tao convoy routes. Think Hellman might be in one of them? Thing is, which one? Take a look at the specs on this one. A lone AV, no ground support, no linked cargo manifests either. Weird. Sure, Kang Tao sometimes transports stuff unregistered if they want to push it under the table, but catch the load on this AV. Already approved in the system, but too low. So definitely no cargo on board. Huh. But there's a passenger list. Kang Tao security detail plus one VIP. Transfer from Chan T. Our boy Hellman. That was the good news. There it is. So what's the bad news? Bad news is the extraction site. Look, Night City airspace. All this. Mm-hmm. No way to jack the transport without the NCPD picking up on. And here, we're too close to Kang Tao. We even give that AV a dirty look. Their backup hustle will be on us. But right here's Jackson Plains. Narrow corridor, just outside the city and just out of Kang Tao's reach. Guess it's your lucky day. Dead zone. I'll grab him there. Gonna need a native to the area. Someone who'll set up the op, cobble together the gear. Even tracking that AV will be a bitch. Familiar with the type. 
Saw legacy models flying around during the war. They're mammoth, but they're quick. Plus, they pack next-gen defenses. Can't take pot shots at it. Not even with serious firepower. Just won't work. It's not about firepower. There are ways, and people who know them. Or who can at least improvise on a theme. So a native. Know any hick mercs? Just one. Pan Am Palmer. She can't count on her clan anymore, but she's a true nomad. She knows those lands. And she will help you. You won't have a choice. Won't have a choice? Does not sound enticing. Not for her and not for me. Enticing comes at a price you can't possibly afford. Can't possibly afford to blow this chance at Nabin Hellman. Your operation, your call. Got a bad feeling, V. Strange. I thought nomads gave the city and city folk a wide berth. Varies by clan, by the connections they have, the depth of shit they're in. But you're right. Alda Caldos are rarely willing to do biz with the city. Pan Am's got a different take? Yep, on everything, it seems. Why's Pan Am gotta help me? I sense a catch. Pretty big one. Occasionally, Pan Am moves merch for me. Last job? Well, wasn't a good day for her. She run into a hitch? Complete bust, actually. Lost the goods and her ride. Pan Am will do anything to get the load back. Means her dignity. I know her. Okay. Guess I can try to help her. But if we don't know where to look, I mean... We do. I do. You know, but wouldn't tell Pan Am. Aim to play cat and mouse with me too? My aim is to know an opportunity when I see one, and then to seize it. Say I told her everything. What do you think she'd have done? Grabbed her iron and gone on the warpath, that's what. Not hard to see how that could end it. And there's nothing I hate more than losing good people to plain stupidity. Huh. I'm her only chance, and she's my only chance. Two pawns on Rogue's board. You're quick. For a pawn. No, oh, Fee. Fine. Let me hear what you know. Rocky Ridge, ghost town just outside Night City. Pan Am knows where. You'll go there, get the merch back. Wheels too. Naturally, you'll call her first. Sending you her deeds. Oh, fine. All clear. Thanks. Let's get out of here. Good luck. Hey, Pan Am. Got your number from Rogue. Name's V. Great. Where's that old warhorse wanna kick me now? Forget Rogue for a minute. I wanna help you. Oh, very kind. But it's far too little, far too late. So do tell Rogue she can eat my oh, shorts. God. Tell it to your therapist. Buffing it up. Calling about your ride and the merch you lost. Interested? Or are you gonna tell me to eat your shorts too? The rail freight yard on Benita Street. The one hugging the city line. We'll meet there. See ya. So there was something unique there, and something new as well. When I stepped away from that interaction, he coughed up blood. And had a little vocal line, like, that's new. So I assume there'll be a few instances like that throughout the game that are just new to flesh out the, uh... The effects of the biochip, right? Which is cool. This thing handles a bit good. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm having a blast. So much has changed. So uh, yeah, I kept hearing people say there's a reason why they call it 2.0, and yeah, I'm, I'm starting to see why. Because 
There's even extra flavor bits throughout the story as well that are new, which is nice. As the mechanics just being completely changed. I haven't seen these stars before, though. These are new. Hmm. Hey, Judy, what's up? Hey. Can you come over to that? Something happened? Yeah. Just come. Well, let's do that first. Some things are really taking me by surprise, like the sound of the weapons, especially the vehicles as well. Basically com completely redone, and they weren't necessarily bad before. Huh, this is a new direction to take me. So the, the, the logic behind the uh, GPS seems to be different as well. Game's working hard all of a sudden, yeah. It's because Bailey was like, how are we enjoying it, huh? And then it was just like, on fire instantly. Beep beep, motherfucker. That's a, that's a bright door. The holy door. In the bathroom. Bird offs herself to express her undying gratitude to you for saving Stop her. talking. I was, I was only gone an hour. this happen? I don't know. I told you. Evie was lying in bed like always when I went out and I got back to... <sighs> Fuck. If I would just known, I'd have... Don't blame yourself. It won't solve anything. I should have sensed something that it was off. <laughs> Stop. Couldn't watch you 24-7. She made up her mind. Would have found a way. Always. Gotta do something with her. Don't want any trouble. I'm calling the badges. Can you carry her to the bed? As if that'll change anything. I need to report an accidental death. North side, Jackson Street. No. No imminent danger. <laughs> Suicide. Tomorrow? No! Today! What part of dead don't you understand? No, she was not pronounced dead by trauma team. If she'd have had coverage, we wouldn't be talking. And fuck you. If you don't want to move your asses, why don't I come down to the precinct and trash it into bits? Now will you come and arrest me, you pussies? Fine, I don't give a fuck what you write me up for. <sighs> They'll be here soon. Oh, 
told me to keep her on ice until tomorrow. Can you believe the balls? All things considered, you let them off pretty light. Had it been me, they'd have gotten an earful like nobody's biz. Put something on her. I'd rather she look like a person than a body. Could you wait outside? Close the door, V. Please. I'm a cig. Didn't know you smoked. Uh, quit. It's been years. But right now I need something besides air in my lungs. Please, V, just one. Here. That was her smoke case. Want to hold on to it? No. You seem to like it. Keep it. Kind of glad it's you that has it, actually. Let her down. I thought if I gave her some t space or time, she'd get back on her feet. I don't know what to say. Never was any good at this stuff. Well, you don't need to talk. I did more for her than anyone else. I had a motive to find her, Judy. You know that. It's what you bring that counts. You gave her the freedom to choose. Yeah, maybe. Just never imagined she'd choose this. Her condition... couldn't think about anything else. Tech-wise, she was clean. Doll Shard was operational, uncorrupted. So... Psychological trauma. Had to be that. Did some more digging in her virtues, found Woodman. He kept her. And had his way with her the things he did and once he got bored he pawned her off I zeroed Woodman didn't plan on it just how the chips landed glad I did though me too I can't even imagine still it's not enough there are so many more like him Gotta be something I can do about it. Like what? Don't know yet. Think I'll call Suze. Thanks, V. Sorry. But, uh, I'd rather be alone now. Promise to keep in touch. Anything comes up, holler on the hollow. Let's try the uh, let's try the gamepad actually. Man, I haven't picked up this controller in a while. That's weird.
So this is all the new music by the community. TLSS 3.5, I'm not using it, so I can tell you. I'm not running any ray tracing, so... Fit def definitely feels better with the driving. It was nice. Hey, Pan Am. So you're a V. Where's my car? We can help each other. Rogue said so. I might have guessed. All right. Tell me all you know. Fail. And you can run back and tell Rogue to fuck right off. Fuck me, you always on the warpath? Only when someone tries to jerk me around. Where the hell is my car? I tell you, and then what? Gonna storm off, handle it all by yourself? That is no concern of yours. None. Listen to me. Listen to me. You need my help. And you'll get it. I mean that. Right after we solve my problem. Fine. Say it. What do you want? Need to hit a Kang Tao transport. Won't be easy. Wanna know I can count on you. Are you out of your goddamned mind? About you or the job. Kang Tao's AV route will take it over Jackson Plains. Heard that should help us. Yeah. I doubt it. Gonna be a guy on board. Need to talk to him. Fuck. In return, inform your cargo. Help in getting back what's yours. We got a deal? I don't know. I... Shit! All right, deal. But if you want your thing done, we'll need to get my Thornton back first. So where is it? Cars in Rocky Ridge. You're supposed to know where that is. Cars there, goods are there. Nash, you dirt-eating bastard. I will strangle you. Rocky Ridge. Let's go. Uh, hang on. I, I, I should think this through. Fuck. Yes. We'll need backup. We have one brief stop to make on the way. Wanna tell me where? Give me a sec. I should call the client. Convince them to leave the bastard hanging. Going ahead with the deal behind Rogue's back. Brave, I guess. Or fucking dumber than a drum. Buzz! Hey! Nash is gonna pass you the merch in Rocky Ridge. The thing is, the motherfucker screwed me over. Boz, I will take care of it. I just need you to give me a chance. 
Boz, come on. How many times have I moved things for you? And how many times have I failed? You have my word. After dark? Okay. No, don't call off the meet. Just don't show up. I'll take care of everything. Do you even have to ask? Of course I will. Thanks, Boz. You won't regret this. Okay. I have bought us some time. Boz? Vista Del Rey, Boz. Had no idea you drive for 6th Street. Is that not allowed? No, nothing wrong with it. They still wild about stars, stripes, and core heartland values? A strong word, wild. And I don't care. They pay well. It's simple. Give that meathead your word and he took it? Is that surprising? It's called having a reputation. You should try getting one of your own. Oh! You! Bitch! So... Where to now? The Aldecaldo camp. I need to see some of the old clan. Don't seem too excited. That's not your concern. I still have friends there. Rogue mentioned your friends. Said you guys stopped seeing eye to eye. Well, since Rogue said so, it must be true. She really doesn't like it. You mean to irritate me. Okay, then. It was just a hiccup. They're still family. So it's complicated. You might say so. Yes. Any chance they might help us? In Rocky Ridge? That is the plan. Alright. Good, let's roll. Get in. Well, this will be our first auto scroll driving cutscene. So I'm curious to see how this looks animation wise. They look much the same. I can tell already. <laughs> nice ride. Lots of space. Practical. Say no more. Please. How far is the camp? Just past the city line. We'll jump on the nine and head east. How the hell did you land in this mess? I liked the color. The air freshener and booster seat came extra. You know I don't mean the car. What am I supposed to tell you? That I'm not about to let my partner rob me and get away with it? That my fixer made me look like a goddamned fool? What about you? Why do you need that clown from the AV? D look where you're going, girl! This particular clown's Shit. got intel I need. And I'm running out of time to get it. So why didn't she tell me she knew about Nash? Rogue? Do better not to wonder what her agenda might be. God damn, I can't stand the bitch. Guess you'll have to ask her yourself. Oh, I'll be sure to. I'll especially ask why she told me to work with Nash, yet forgot to mention he was Raffin. Wait, Nash is Raffin? Yes. He runs with the Wraiths, the largest Raffin group in the area. You know about them, right? Mm hmm. Nomads tossed out of clans. Yes, mostly. Nomads don't banish their own without a reason. So think murderers, rapists, freaks. They gather in teams. Sometimes form actual gangs. Most of them are wanted and have warrants on their heads. Shit. And that bitch had me working with scum like that. Must have had her reasons. You don't say. Rogue won't open her mouth without weighing the for and against. What to spill and what to withhold. Yeah, I'm starting to get hungry. Might have to indulge a bit because I keep—I want to keep streaming. I'm—I'm uh, I'm enjoying this. It's working, chat. I'm getting sucked in. Uh, 
the big <laughs> immersion okay, we're soak. There. We'll gather my guys, then ride to Rocky Ridge. what the cat dragged in. Is that a ghost or is it just my hangover? Fuck you too. Mm-hmm. And who's this? My babysitter. V, this is Scorpion. Mitch. Two old friends. What brings you to these parts, city girl? The big city got too I didn't realize there was a time run that. Oops. Do you have any idea how angry the old man's gonna be when he sees you here? I've just come by for a spell. Saul needn't know a thing. Need your help. With what? What's this about? Raffin screwed Pan Am. Plan is to show him that was a bad idea. How bad did they get you? Bad enough to make me sit quietly through all your bullshit. You know, we would do anything for you, sister. But now? Now's hard. Seriously? You won't help? Uh, well, the old man told us to sit tight and get those generators back up after the batteries went kaput. Generators? You won't help because of some goddamn generators? Is this another joke? Really could use your help. Not this time. We're needed here. Fuck. I don't believe this. So you'll stay put because Saul told you to. You couldn't care less about me. Pan Am, this isn't about Saul. It's about the clan. You know that. Listen, we can't leave camp. No chance. But, but Saul never said a thing about gear. Okay. Well, I'll need that rifle of yours. And some of my own stuff. Take whatever you want. And take care of yourself out there. Yeah. Thanks, guys. I'll grab the gear, then be out of your hair. Looks like you're stuck with me. Mm-hmm. You disappointed? I don't know. Maybe a little, yes. Hey, Pan Am. Are you staying a while? No, I'll be going again soon. We'll talk next time. Hey, Pan Am. Man, got fucking blanked. Have you brought someone new? Does Saul know? Not your concern, friend. Will you help me with this? What's inside? A few odds and ends that should be useful. Take it. All right, that's everything. Let's go. Did you figure out your differences with Saul? Will you come back? Blanked again. Pan Am, you'll stop by later, right, honey? Next time, Ellie. I promise. So, I'm off. Yeah, yeah, go on, go already. Call us sometime. Keep an eye on her, V. Put it in the trunk. We can go. Hop in. Those two in the army? Scorp and Mitch? Yeah. Panzer boys. They were on contract during the last war. Panzer boys? Flew those huge transporters? Scorpion piloted. Mitch ran security. 
They both got some kick-ass combat implants and a stack of really fucked up nightmares. Mitch and Scorpion seem good souls. The best friends a girl could ask for. I'd stay in the camp too if I were in their shoes. Fuck Saul and his generators, of course. Yet the clan comes first. But I'm not part of it anymore. Still treated you like you're one of them. They care about you. Mm-hmm. Do you have anyone you would call close? Haven't been so lucky. I see. So, Rocky Ridge. Empty, dusty hole in the middle of bumfuck nowhere, I heard. Natives either moved to Night City or just got the hell out. Then you know almost all there is to know. The whole area was waiting on a new interstate extension. It was supposed to breathe new life into the town. It didn't happen, of course. How many ghost towns do you think are there? Hundreds? Countrywide? Thousands. I drove down I-80 the other day. All you have to do is pull over after sundown. It's quiet then. And you hear it. What's that? The wind whistling through boarded up windows. Tumbleweeds scratching across dry, sandy tracks. That's how towns die. Not with a bang, but with whispers and whimpers. Seems you got a real problem with authority. What? Rogue, Saul. He your leader? Their leader. Seemed in a hurry to delta the hell out of there. Let's just say Saul wouldn't have been happy to see me. What happened? The reason we came to California was because he promised change for the Alda Caldos. He claimed we would turn over a new leaf. But you saw it. We got a handful of tents on a heap of sand. A hell of a promised land. I wanted something different. Better. Saul's a damned coward. He'll be the end of the clan, I'm certain. Well, this is nice, isn't it? Taking a drive. Pity it's over. Okay, we have arrived. What do we do? We get ready to greet the Raffins, and we've little time for that. We'll need to improvise. We should scout first, to look for anything that might be useful. Doubt Rocky Ridge could be any deader. Everything's down. Nothing works here. Well? Have you found anything? I got nada. You have an epiphany? The Raffins will roll in after dusk, right? We will have a surprise ready for them. We just need to get some power flowing. No dice. Nothing's up. All cut off. So we plug it back in. Let's check the substation. You got it. Work out too well for these guys, didn't it? Well, just as well there is no power, I would be dead. Found the breakers, but there's no juice on them. Not to worry. Come down. I know how to surprise the bastards. Right. So, the intersection is powered from that transformer substation, right? The switch gear on the roof. We'll flip the switch there and everything will light up like Christmas. Understood? So, classic route. Good old diversion. You know it. First, we don't know how many are coming. My thinking is it'll be a sizable crew. Second, we have to create an opening to get to my car. If they're bunched together, we won't stand a chance. So we give them a little light show at the intersection? Yes. We'll breathe some life into this dusty old town. <laughs> as soon as they that? see the lights, they'll have to check who, why, and how. Nova. Yep. First we start up the control terminal below. 
The gear on the roof is a hunk of junk without it. Come on, we'll give it a boost from the car battery. That should do the trick. Wait for me by the substation. I'll bring the car. <laughs> is it meant to be a bird? Wow. <laughs> it's a very flat bird. <laughs> Strong. Panel looks to be in good shape. I'll make a bypass circuit to the power supply. That should do it. We'll just have to get it up and running. Grab the jumper cables from the trunk. We'll boost it from the car battery. Red cable connected. Give me a moment. I need to hook everything up here. And done. Now the Black Rattler. There she goes. Thought the old jalopy served us well. Okay, I've got voltage. Start the terminal inside. And once the power is on in the building, get on that roof. You got it. I'll set up on the tower. We'll have the whole intersection on a platter. You flip the breakers when I give you the signal. Hope to do so, understood? Yes, ma'am. Switch gears got power. Prime. We'll have some fun at the intersection. Let's get into position. Raffins will come from where? Any idea? The northeast, I wager. From the freeway that was never finished. Got it. Cover me, just in case. Of course. They're rolling in. In my thorn. You see her? Really, really hard to miss. Let's take them by surprise. Let's try to do this quietly. If anything happens, I'll start picking them up. Sound good? Sounds great. I'm here. Get good and ready. The show starts now. Let there be light. What the fuck is going on? Oh! <laughs> It was a good way to start, wasn't it? And then it all just fell apart. Maybe I should pick some off with guns first, then start going crazy with the melee. It's so weak, though, at the moment. Oh, God. Ah! <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, okay, he's strong. Okay. Okay. All right. This is a fight. This was... This is kind of a non-event before. This is... This is good. <laughs> Do you reckon I can get to her from here? Let's try it. No, it did not work. <laughs> oh! I killed the one that I needed to die, so... Ooh, Jesus Christ. He's about to Kill you? Yeah. I was. Getting shot up the ass as well. Date Lups and Pro Tip. Do take lead up the ass. Or at least understand the dangers. If you do. Him unclear. I guess the real pro tip is do what you like, just understand the hazards. Oh, that door did, does not want to close. Oh, shit. Too much UI. Man, you can take a beating, huh? Get in the car out of here. No need to risk it. Oh, I've never had this happen before. Oh! Oh. I forgot he was there. Hey, George. God damn. Oh, get away from those, they're gonna blow up. Hmm. Ammo. 
Oh, it's becoming a bit of a problem. Hang on. I wonder if I can do this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Disgusting. I love it. Oh, come on. Let's try it from, from above. Yeah. Oh, I don't want that. Piss off. Corpses? I'll take the wheel. Sure, sure. Leave the driving to the pros. Uh, no, Bacho. I think the whole point of the area is that it was abandoned because there's no, like, business or anything there, right? There were, I think it said earlier on, didn't it, that there was going to be, like, a a highway yeah. plan and it She's didn't go through, wheels, so all, all kind of business just fell flat in the area. So they all sort of moved to the city. Dreamy indeed. No surprise you wanted her back. She completes me. See? Managed just fine without Mitch and Scorpion. Now welcome back, Red. Listen, V, it's not over yet. It's not? You got the cargo, you got your car. I did not get Nash, who was not in Rocky Ridge. The fucker didn't show. A sniper rifle incident in this scene. <laughs> I don't remember. What's gotten into you? Sorry, I was just talking to my chat. Pan Am. Listen, I have a plan. And I don't care. The car and the merch, that's what we were after. We got him. Sixth Street away from Just listen to I me, for fuck's sake. I know where their little hidey hole is. We'll take the old unfinished freeway nearby. They will not be expecting us. I'm sure of it. Oh, really? I don't remember that ass. <laughs> I must have forgotten about it. V? All right. So where's this hideout? A hop and skip away. Thanks, V. What Nash did. I placed my trust in him. He was the first person I worked with after leaving the Alda Caldos. After I came to Night City. And I granted him my trust. It's the mistake of the maker! I get it. I don't know how you feel. I had someone betray me just like that once. And did you make them pay? Never got the chance. Someone else got to him first. Yeah, I was but robbed of that, right? Would you have done it? No doubt. Without skipping a beat. Let's get this over with. Are you ready? Let's get him. Right. Let's see how jank this animation through here looks. Yeah, it's still oh, it's still dreadful. Okay, they didn't fix this. That's sad. <laughs> Where are 
you going? Oh. <laughs> Oh, really? Some of these guys are fucking hooked up with cybernetics and shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Well, our weapon glitch is fine. I need heals. for this. I need something... <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, maybe I can use the sand Deviston to slow time to go for the headshots on the other ones that have a sand Deviston as well. Uh, junky animations, my favorite. It's all too late anyway, because I can't, uh, I can't craft another weapon even if I wanted to right now. Um, Whiffing all the shots. Oh, what are you doing? Nasty hit you took there. Fuck yeah! It's really no good! Mighty impressive. There, I admit it. Oh! 
I don't know what my health was at, but that, I know what weapon killed me, and uh, I don't think it really would have mattered what my health was at. Okay, this is- I, I'm enjoying the challenge of this, though. I need to... figure out what kind of combat I want to go for, because... at the moment, as much as I'd love to get stuck in with melee, it's just- I can't tank enough damage on this difficulty. Using cover is always going to be best, but... I can't cover from those kind of weapons, because they fucking... Shoot through walls and stuff. I've got the wrong fucking heal equipped anyway. Man, whiffing some of these shots. I 
I need to heal, and then we can go in for the last one. Okay, it will heal me. <laughs> it's recovering at the bottom left. Okay, well, I can actually save now, because we've stalled combat, so... Didn't even need them in the end. I went so fast past the guy, he didn't even fucking see me. Alright, well we're done. Give. Thank you. Oh. Whoop. Oh, cool. Skill shard, then. Hello, Rogue. Pan Am. What did you say again? Solve your own problems? Clean up your shit? Nash is dead. One shit cleaned. Happy? And the 6th Street merch? Nash can't deliver it anymore. But if you ask nicely, I might be able to help you. Help me? I take my cut up front, honey. But I guess I'm touched. Was actually wondering if you wouldn't forget about Biz while you were out chasing down a vendetta. Fuck! <laughs> Got him! <laughs> As always. So, feel any better? Maybe a little. Let's get out of here. What bitter cold Whoop. bitch that broke. Think she might have lost the plot. Mean to say she used to be sweet and alluring? Huh. <laughs> Never that. But she's no stranger to the other end of the stick. Think she might need a nice strong shock. Hey, boss. Got your cargo. No, no fast ones. Come on, let's meet. Sunset Motel. I know you're not kidding. I'm certain to be there. Whoa! Okay. Don't drive through shit! Let's wow. do the deal and start working on Hellman. Agreed? Sunset Motel, what's that? A safe spot. It's not far from here. It's right there. Should be fun. Very legal speed limits. You love to see it. That's new. <laughs> They're here. Let me do the talking. Sensing trouble? No. At least I don't think so. seem to be answering his phone. Don't call him anymore. There's no need. <laughs> you got balls, girl. What's this? A bonus of some sort? We work together. Hmm. Change tunes like you change clothes, girl. There. First class merch. Uh-huh. So. 
Everything's in order? Check your account. Should be pretty plush in a couple of minutes. It's been a pleasure. But I believe Rogue's the one who is to pay me. You're all right. I think you earned a tip. Let's roll. That went well. Come on. Let's get a drink. Raffin's wiped. Six. The day's not over. Wrong button. Over yet? You still have a chance to piss me off. or new friends back there? Take a wild guess. Is everything good with you? Did those bozos come around again? Raffins? Nah, it's been quiet. They'll be back, sure enough. But this place has seemed worse. What can I get you? Brosif. Two of them. So that package for Street, what was it? You didn't peek? Valoperidol. Drugs for the cyber psychos in our midst. They trade in them? Yes. They have deals. With black clinics, rippers... Well, here's to that thorn of yours. Thanks for everything, partner. Damn, girl. Come up for it. Another one over here. Sucks to be you. Mine's never ending. Thanks, Noah. Cheers. Let me know if you need anything else. Beer. The Elder Caldas. Think he'll ever go back? I mean, not right now, but someday. I don't rightly know. On the one hand, I don't have anyone outside the clan. Shit, I don't really know any other life. But on the other? Without my clan, who am I? Who would I become if I stayed in Night City? You could always try it out. See who you become in Night City. Except, City doesn't always play fair. Don't know if it's worth sacrificing your friends along the way. You mean Mitch? Scorpion? Come on. Sooner or later, Pan Am, the city will suck you in. You won't need to cut whatever ties you got left at the Albacaldos. Because the city will do that for you. I guess I should think about it. Don't make trouble. The Raffins. We done with them? Oh, no. The Shiver cockroaches. One's never rid of them. But it should be quiet for a time. They'll need to gather their wits and dust themselves off. All right. Time we look to my needs. What's the plan for Hellman? I've come up with a plan. A first draft. But I need to sleep on it. Work it out. Then we can talk about the details. I think it best to rent rooms here. Just to stay in the area. We'll get to work around midnight. It'll help keep us out of sight. Agreed? Good idea. Let's see. <laughs> I only just noticed the top option. No, How about we just we'll get one rooms. room smooth? I'll go catch a few winks. See you later. And the best chefs in the universe. If you're looking for a taste of paradise, don't wait a microsecond longer. Send space to 729. I'm going to order some food cuz I'm I'm game to keep streaming for for a little while longer yet. What day is it tomorrow? Tomorrow's a Friday. Um, probably stream the same again tomorrow. Um, hopefully get started a bit earlier. Expect the long streams over the next uh, 
week or two. <laughs> oh, that looks lovely. Oh, that's the gun I was using earlier on, you know, it seems quite accurate. <laughs> Why have they got the Just Ads channel on? It's literally Just Ads. There's no TV. It's Just Ads. Oh, yeah. <laughs> How do you like the ads, chat? Are they good? <laughs> so I'm just I'm just picking what I want to eat for food, so that's why I'm not doing anything right now. for a tree. Oh, there's a there was another release that happened today by the way that's really quite big for me anyway. Um, Resident Evil 4 Remakes DLC released today. I played a little bit of it last night and uh, it's pretty damn good. I don't know if I'll stream that one though. from Ada's view. Yeah, separate ways. Um, and just from the bit I've played, it seems way better than separate ways was in the original. Like, the one in the original, like Ada's assignment, are both like really bad asset flips to try and justify them selling it on PS2. Because that game originally only launched on GameCube. And then when they released it on PS2, they released it with... I don't know if it was with both of those, I'd imagine at least uh, separate ways, but... The locations and the cutscenes and everything, it was only $7.99. Which I think is fine, for, from what I've played already, so... And th that's the good thing about Resident Evil, it's always got good replayability. Yeah, separate ways, that's the one. Let's have a chat with the gun store. Yeah? What's up in the big world? What are you carrying? Firearms. Best in all the Badlands. Alright, what you got? Some specs for LMGs.
Critiche. <laughs> nice name. Uh, maybe I will play it on stream, but I don't think I'm... I have any interest in playing it on stream anytime soon. I think what I'll end up doing is I'll play it off stream, and then when I feel like playing RE4 Remake again at some point in the future, it, it might even be in October, because Resident Evil's kind of horror-like, right? So might fit in with that. But, uh, yeah. I, I want to play Cyberpunk for the time being. That's going to keep me busy until at least... Um, at least until October. <clears throat> but uh, it's definitely answered all my uh, concerns about eye racing. I just don't have time to play eye racing at the moment. <laughs> if I feel like driving, I play a bit of AC, and then I've got all these other games that I'd rather be playing, obviously. So, but uh, I'll definitely. get back to iRacing at some point. Which is probably not for a while. Okay, can sell some of these. Don't want the LMG. I want a specific rifle is what I want, but it still hasn't shown up. She doesn't have it either. Mm. Spoopy season coming. Daytona 24. Uh, well, I don't know. LMDH is at Daytona 24. Could maybe justify it a bit better. Hell, I don't even think the P2 would be that bad. It's just... It's a boring-ass track. The size is... Yeah, I think you're, I think you're right. <laughs> just like... Fuck. <laughs> I want to want to do it. But you can't... You can't just force something like that, can you? I'm selling all these, fuck it. I think the combination of just not being familiar with eye racing anymore and then knowing that the last times I did Daytona in any shape or form, I didn't really enjoy the driving aspect of it. But you know, the, the team aspect of it is always appealing, so... Uh, never say never, I guess. Ugh. How about you? I like sleeping with the door open. Hey, the door closed on me again! This happened last time. MP3 at Le Mans was so much fun. Looking forward to testing the P2 out this week. Awesome, man. My name is yeah. Dakota Smith. If you're looking for jobs out here, you will find them with me. Name is V. I'm in. Thanks for the intel. Things flow differently out here. Keep your head on, city kid. Alright, let me be obnoxious about it. Condescending about it. Look at that smile. <laughs> Stare. That, that is literally smile face, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I think we need that as an emote. I'm going back. Does someone want to screenshot this for me? I 
wait for it. There you go. Look at that big old cheesy grin. It can be V-Smile. <laughs> Look how happy he is. I could have 12 it, to be honest. I'm just, I'm just going to assume someone grabbed a screen of that. If not, I can always get it another time. Suspension. The hydraulics have to be ship shape. We're in for a bumpy ride. Did you sleep all right? Can't complain. Yeah. You sleep well? Like a baby on a bumpy road. Come up with anything? For Hellman, I mean. As a matter of fact, I did. New episodes every Wednesday. Look here. Okay, tell me. We're the wrench. The cutter is the AV. And the screwdriver is where the AV should bury its nose cone in the dust. Now you must be wondering how we get the AV to do that. That old HMG of yours. My gun will be useful elsewhere. This caliber would barely dent the armor of a heavy hitter like that. There are other ways. Here, the clamps are solution. A sat wave power station. Um, Satwave power station? Yes. We need to break into it. Mm-hmm. So far, so good. But then what? And then we strike. We hit the AV with an EMP. Of course we do. As soon as the AV is in range, we cause an electromagnetic pulse. The onboard electronics should fail outright. Meaning what? Engines will shut down? Everything will shut down. Engines included. Drive, navigation, communication systems. Aren't you, uh, counting chickens? We can't actually know the AV will fly over the station. Of course we can't, but we don't have to. You'll see. It's bound to be quite a ride, but not one you'll regret. I've got everything planned out. All right, let's ride. Great, hop in. It's cold out here. Who owns this power station? Gov or Corp? Is there any difference? Who do you think pulls the government's strings? Hey, I'm just wondering whose toes we're about to step all over. V, look around. It is simple. Everything you see is owned by a corporation. <laughs> I've just seen your, uh, your screen grabs in, in Discord. Cheers, guys. <laughs> it's what a face. You like to mess with the corpse, huh? Whatever gave you that idea. Or wait. Scratch that. Rogue, Nash, the Rathens. You're on thin ice, B. You just like to mess with everyone. Well, then I suppose it's a good thing I'm on your side, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And now for something completely different. Weirdest thing you've ever transported. Go. What? Are we playing 20 questions? Come on, answer. The deputy finance director of Kaukaz. That's chauffeuring, not smuggling. He rode in the trunk. Flatlined. Really? Dead? A long story. Maybe someday I'll tell you. Is this where we get to hear about the impressive cock? I think this is. We've almost reached the dam. We'll make a quick stop here. We need to calibrate you with a turret. I want you to be able to use the gun, too. It should up our chances in general. Connect here. How should I connect? Personal link? How else? Just watch the jack. Sometimes you have to jig a little bit. Wired in. Wait a moment. Diagnostics first. 
Shit, it keeps giving me an error. Odd. Let me work around it. And now, Pan Am, here's Johnny. Out in the middle of bumfuck nowhere. Great work, V. Hey, uh, I think your implant has a virus. The one in the nape of your neck. I know, but it's nothing to worry about. Nothing dangerous or anything. Maybe for you. But this vehicle only has basic security soft. If it's something Don't advanced... Don't worry. Nothing too advanced. <laughs> Pretty backwards, actually. Real fucking funny. <laughs> you would better see a ripper doc after all this is over. All right, Mom. Okay. Here goes nothing. See that pile of junk? Fire a short burst into it. I'll take care of the caliber. Good. Next target. Single shot. Okay. Just one more. Longer round. Great. We're done, I think. And the noise it makes. It? So where's this power station? You will see in a moment. I know a spot. We'll have a decent view from there. I just want to be sure the area is clear. Sabotage a corpo power station. Jump a corpo transport. Kidnap a corpo suit. Is this a plug for the word corpo, or do you have a point? Know what? You're starting to remind me of me. Fifty years back. Minus the charisma. An impressive cock. Hmm. Maybe we can just get along. Let me remind you. I want Hellman from me. Not to stick it to Arasaka. This is life or death. My life I mean, let me death. remind you that Sokka and their fucked up tech is what got you here. Who gives a shit about motives? Ends justify the means, and right now your end is to survive. Yep, indeed. Massive yep moment. <laughs> All looks clear. The area looks deserted. I see no patrols. The huge thing is the collection unit. And see the antennas? Each antenna collects microwave energy from satellites in orbit. That's then converted into electric power. Antennas run all the way down the interstate. Mm-hmm. And they're linked, which is to your advantage. We just need to mess with the collection unit. A chain reaction will follow. Each one of the antennas will emit an EMP burst. The AV will be like a fly headed for a spider's web. We just have to fire off the pulse at the right moment. Let's go get her. Once we reach the station, I'll set up a bypass for the detonator. You just overload the systems. Overload the system? Yes, ma'am. When do I start? Though, hoping that's not too complicated. Is it? It shouldn't be. You just turn everything up as far as it'll go. Crank it up to 11. Got it. So what now? We wait. We should time our arrival to the AV flight. Got it. Good. Time to roll. Done anything like this before? Downing an AV? By myself? No. Why do you ask? Power station, EMP, the systems, networks. Came up with a really solid plan. Thank you. How you approach things, that's the trick. Mine is the AAA. Wait, what now? Assessment, assembly, action. Whatever your task, you do three things. Start by assessing what you already have and what you'll face, the problem. Then you plan with those variables in mind. Take what you have, get what you need, assemble things, people. Finally, you take action. Simple. Got one word for you. T-shirts. AAA. It's all you need to lead the good life. That and the occasional cold beer. Method. Triple A. That all you? <laughs> Not at all. I learned it from the Elder Caldos. Mitch and Scorpion. They were trained in something like it during the war. Then they made it their own. It's come in handy, I can't deny. And it will again now. 
What if, uh, something goes ass up? Well, then your ass had better improvise. Did you really? Okay, we'll be there in a moment. One last time. We drive in, fuck up the system, and get the hell out of there. Hold on tight. This could get a little bumpy. Get ready. Okay, I'm ready. They really are tanky. I don't even think there was that many of them before. Ah, shit. But they definitely didn't take anywhere near that amount of damage. Come on. Breathe. Ah, shit. I think we might have overdone it, Pan Am. At 11, you got a Fuck yeah. Let's get out of here before it lights us up, too. V, get the fuck out before something happens to the chip. Thanks for the tip. You know, I was just about to set up a picnic. Maybe we'll lay out. Work on I my mean base, Dad. Watch out. The next one might. Johnny? Johnny? Okay, I'm fine. It's it's okay, just it's okay, I'm fine. Yeah. Just delta the fuck out. Not the cleanest job, perhaps, but it still went well. What about the detonator? Is it working? Yes, it's working. And I don't even see a drop in the signal strength. We just need to drive far away enough to keep the pulse from blasting us, too. The cliff there. We'll set up. It should give us a good view of the antennas. And then we wait. Okay. Here. Always wanted to push the big red button on something like this. How do we know when? Don't worry. I'll... I'll have eyes on it. You just wait for my signal, then set off that pulse. They won't know what hit them. And by the way... What? We are about to knock a multi-million euro dollar Kang Tao asset clean out of the sky. How does that make you feel? Blasting shit. Exactly what the doc ordered. And that's exactly what I like to hear. Just noticed. What? It's quiet. The hum of the city, people's voices, the smells. It's all gone. Wind just intensifies it. Think I forgot quiet exists. Mm-hmm. Though maybe not the smells. I mean, the coyotes. Rather hard to miss. Thought that was just the air freshener in your Thornton. Ha ha. Screw you. You'd do better to focus on the AV. Keep your eyes open. Pacifica. 
All right, get ready. One more second. One more. Now! Boom. There she is. Shit! What's, What's going happening? on? Fucking hell. Bullseye! Pan Am, the engines are still running. Fuck, they're getting away. They're going nowhere. We gotta go after it. Give me a moment. Pan Am, what are you doing? Altitude. We got the bastard. Let's go. We got it. No way it stays in the air after a blast like that. We either land or crash. You catch that? Oh. Over. AV unmarked. Losing out. Fetch. There. Scorpion. What the hell are they doing? Finishing up at the generators. Follow them. On my way in a bit. Battery Mitch, should sort Scorpion, itself out. It's Pan Am. Don't go near that AV. I repeat, do not approach the AV. <laughs> On the way, or I'll start the party without you. It's Kang Tao! Wait for me! Or better, get the hell out! They probably want to help the survivors, without knowing it's corporate. They can't hear me! The pulse is interfering! Shit! I have three on radar! Drones? Yes. Get ready. They're trying to slow us down! We won't let them! We have to reach Mission Scorpion! that hill. Well, one less thing to worry about. Oh. Pan Am, you okay? It's fucking ricochet. Think you can manage? Sure. I'll live. Don't worry. Hey, man, where are you? Hello? Mm -hmm. Perfect. Scorpion. Keep broadcasting over an open channel, just in case they missed you the first time. God, I swear. Something's not right. Did you hear those shots? V, something happened to them. Let's check it out. I see the wreck, but no scorpion or Mitch. Yo, take it easy, Red. It's expired. Thanks for watching. Uh, fuck. Ugh. V, connect to the drone. We'll scan the area. We have to get our bearings. Let's roll. You connecting to visual? Mm-hmm. V. If they got the Aldecaldus, if they got Mitch and Scorpion, I can't... I don't... No, I know. Connected. I'm in control. Oh, no. No, no. I'm... I'm sorry. Your clan? Alta Caldos. Yes. They're dead. All of them. V, if they... Don't worry. We don't know for sure. Mitch! He's alive! They have them! They've set up the launcher. 
They'll tear us to shreds if we get too close. Can we take it down somehow? Maybe. But we have to get there first. Got five Kangs on patrol. If not for those damned glitches, I could have warned them! This is all my doing! Why in the hell were they following the A.V.? The fools! Listen, we saw Mitch. They probably got Scorpion too. We'll find them. Help them out. If they're still alive... They're alive. Everything's gonna be okay. Mind that launcher. It will blow us to bits if we approach. Okay, here's the plan. You stay in the car, No, I... not so fast. I will go with you. Those are my people. Pan Am. Hate to break it to you, but you're hurt. Wait in the car. I'll try and take out the launcher. I... Fine. But I have Mitch's rifle. I will try to cover you from here. Good idea. Let's move. Fuck it, I don't think there's really much I can do to make this easier on me, so I'm just gonna... Okay. <clears throat> I didn't see that the turret tried shooting. Ripperoni. I'm wondering if I can rush it and shut it down before I get killed. Let's try it. I'm gonna die.
Weapons, do I? Nope. <clears throat> well, shit. Now, step back, back, toss your weapons or I'll shoot. I repeat, drop your weapons now. Right, easy now. Not too late for everyone to walk out of this alive. We called for backup. Bullshit. Last chance. You don't got to die today. Let's talk. Why should I believe you? Pan Am, shoot Shut him. Up. Listen. This isn't about you. Let him go and tell me where I, your passenger is. I, I don't know where they took him. Hell no. He's lying. Look, you. You got two seconds to make up your damn mind. Alda Caldo's right up here any minute now. They headed west for the gas station. But I can't guarantee Pan they're Am, still there. You remember the Shut cowboy. Shut the fuck up! Fuck! Pan Am! God damn it. Oh, shit. Are you all right? Uh, just some scratches. You fucking morons! Did you get hit? Hang on, girl. I'll patch it's you up. nothing. Let's go. We couldn't retreat, Pan Am. They regrouped so fast. Started shooting rockets and shit. I lost everyone. Everyone? Scorpion, is he here? Mitch? Mitch? He's... He's safe, Pan right? Pan Am, I'm sorry. I didn't make it in time. No! No! Are you sure? No, he... Scorpion, the rest. I'm sorry we didn't get here sooner. They were good people. Great people. They didn't have to die here. I should have stopped him. I tried. He wouldn't have listened to you either. Never was much of a listener. Stubborn bastard. I'm guessing since you were out here, you were out here for the A.V. The question is, why? I need the man who was riding this A.V. Pilot said they headed west. Yep. Took him with them. In our cars. Pilot was telling the truth. There's an old gas station out there. Must be looking for a way to call base. So you're the ones who hit him with that EMP? Yeah, we tried to warn you, but... Couldn't connect. What's the plan now, V? I'll go after him. Stay with Mitch. I'll be fine. I'm going with you. I promised I would help. Besides, those bastards killed Scorpion. I won't let that go. Don't argue with her, V. No point. Go. I'll call my people. We'll take care of things here. We'll leave my ride here just in case. Just watch the gun. It likes to jam. We'll go by bike. Sounds solid. If they made it to the station, they're probably waiting on backup. Better hurry. But Pan Am... What? You're coming back for her, right? I promise. Let's get going, before they send a rescue party. All right, chat, I'm gonna just go and eat for a bit, and I'll be back... Uh, probably like five minutes or so.
I can save some of it for, for cutscenes and stuff, but yeah. Back in a few. Ray Parker Jr. Here we go with Ghostbusters. <laughs> Thank you. 
Let me tell you something. Sleeping makes me feel good. I ain't afraid of no sleeping. I ain't afraid of no bed. An invisible bed. The freaky ghost bed. Yeah, 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 If I could, bitch. All right, I think I'm about done. Whew. That's good shit. Bitch. It doesn't even fit the screen because it's at like 2K. Bitch. Bitch. You said, um, you said rolling, 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 and then like, not long after that, I suddenly went, Busting, busting, busting. Oh shit, we haven't listened to busting in a while, so. And I was busy stuffing my face anyway, so why not? Busting, busting. Let's delta to that station. <clears throat> Hope you know a shortcut. Mm hmm. Get ready. The bikes are fine. Hop on. some sort of a prototype. I think it was Militech. You don't remember? Anyway, chased the guy through three states, only to fish his body up out of the lake. Killed himself? Doubt it. Think they hit him with a virus. Anyway, lost control. Probably suffocated before he could drown. That is fucked up. You stop thinking about all that sad shit for a moment, right? Set up shop here. I see. They must have held up somewhere. Buffy, see that? The pumps look pretty good. Not what you would find if the place were closed. The bastards might have managed to call for transport. We'll know soon enough. 
It's literally an Aldo Caldo's car right there. Get out and help us, bro. Got the know-how. Let me through a skylight or something, damn it. Sweet, 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 sweet. 
He was just about to heal the sneaky fucker. Oh no, you don't. <clears throat> oh, this one was this one was here. Why? Okay, that's great now, huh? Oh shit. Shoot, I'm unarmed. The hell are you doing here? This is my station. Name's Marty. Those fucking suits rode up like they own the place. Took everything. Put me here and locked the door. Don't look too concerned. Ain't my first rodeo. Once the dust falls, the problems disappear one way or another, and I... I just dust myself off and get back to work. Brought a man with them. A man I need. Civilian. He must have spotted him. Mm-hmm. I ain't blind. Where are they holding him? Old garage. Room upstairs. Probably keeping him there. Thanks. If I were you, I'd stay put for a few. Exactly my intention. He ain't stupid. Know where they're keeping Hellman. Going in. Okay. Covering you. The sound of that. Ah, oh, disgusting. Who sent you? Hey, easy. We gotta talk. Who are you working for? You're in Obu Arasaka. Do you wish to take me back? Pathetic or? rat's got nowhere left to scurry off to. He's out of lifelines. Shut him up already. Not a fan, I take it. You haven't found a fan in him either. Motherfucker doesn't know who to be scared of more. You or our Saka. Don't take this personally. I seem to recall you were gonna tell Takamura when you got Helmet. Yeah, just a sec. I'll call him. Just remember, you have Hellman, and that's one hell of a car. Try to win something with it. Takamura saved my life, remember? Because it was in his fucking interest to do so. Still just biz. He's no friend of yours. Takamura, good news. Got Hellman. Alive. What did he say? Alive, alive. Not too talkative now. Taking him to the Sunset Motel. I will come to you. Keep him there until I arrive. You got it. See ya. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. Hellman. Mr. Mayonnaise, let's go. Better take him somewhere you can talk at peace. True. Like your new chimbas are here. Is that him? Sure is. Take him outside. Toss him on the bike. Stay right there. The cavalry has arrived. Mitch gathered together a few elder helmets. <clears throat> the road was clear. I don't think we were spotted. We would still do better not to hang around too long. What do you plan to do with him? Trust me, the less you know, the better. Tell me next time, then. Saul. Everything's done here. 
All clear. I heard Mitch is alive thanks to you. Thanks to V and Pan Am. They both saved my ass. I just hope he was worth it. Saul, I tried to raise Scorpion, but he... Maybe I could help out somehow? I think you've helped enough. I tried to stop him. Sure. Just turn around now. Let it all be damned. You're good at that, aren't you? Thanks for the support. You helped us, we help you. Have a safe return. He seems happy. Right? Right? Damn it all. Look at this guy over here. The larger, the guy of larger stature. What's he staring at, man? He looks like he's. <laughs> We've got eyes all around. Mm -hmm. We'll want to see him coming. <laughs> Look at him. He's just staring off into space. Glad to see you, Mitch. But why'd you even come? Saul. He came with our people. We took care of the bodies. I told him what happened, and he told us to up and follow you. He was worried something would happen to you. To Pan Am. Saul? Look, maybe you two don't see eye to eye at the moment, but you're family. And Saul will do anything for family. The thing is, am I even part of the family? She burger. <laughs> you know you are. Come back to us. <laughs> That's what he's thinking, is it? She I understand. Sorry you had to witness that. Things just get complicated. Dramatic Wide sometimes. open cheese, but bro. I will manage. And you, you look out for yourself, all right? Mmm. Cheeseburger. Until next time. They're coming. You got a minute. Let's move. He's Until still standing time. there. Take care of Scorpion's Dude. bike. It's Dude, stop now. thinking of the cheeseburger. <laughs> Hurry, they're coming. What is this place? Motel, middle of nowhere. Any specific middle? Doesn't matter. You're not leaving here by yourself anyway. Why are we here? Want to talk about your little invention. Biochip you made for Arasaka. Fine. But let's get one thing straight first. Yorinobu Arasaka didn't send you? No. This means you must have an offer for me. If your boss will pay more than Kang Tao, I believe we can talk. You misunderstand me. There is no offer. What do you want? Got Silverhand's construct in my head. It's literally driving me crazy, and I know it's only gonna get worse. That is, unless I remove it. And that, none of that's on the billboards I saw. Not even in the fine Silverhand? Construct? That's impossible. Where did you get this biochip? Clept it off Yorinobu Arasaka. Job for a client. But the client left me out And of you decided the best place for it was in your own goddamn head. Actually, wasn't a bad idea. Construct rebooted me when my own goddamn head took a bullet. I always knew Yorinobu's plan would fail. I just never imagined it would turn out like this. Arisaka's prized tech really is in the very streets of the city. You have to remove the biochip from my system. It's not that simple. Look, you made the thing, didn't you? So where's the problem? If you're telling the truth, you slotted in a new experimental version of the biochip. I know you can't just yank it out. My Ripper you said- You showed that to some fucking street doctor? Who else knows? I needed help. Or did you think the first thing that came to mind was down in a Kang Tao AV? How's the prototype version different? It's got a different engram, something more Aware. aggressive. Cheeseburger. The biochip is what's unique, not Silverhand's engram. The previous version of the chip was only used to communicate with pre-saved engrams. It was rare as fuck and cost a fortune. Yeah. This one's rarer. Meant to install and activate the engram in a new body. When I left Arisaka, the project was still in the trial phase. 
How exactly was this new version supposed to work? Were you planning to have the engram kick people out of their own bodies? Is that shit by design? During the tests, we assumed that the body would be neurally indifferent during implantation. You mean dead? Yes, which makes what happened to you interesting indeed. How do you put a price on immortality? Who could even afford tech like this? Nobody. This model was meant to remain in-house. The prototype was Saburo Arasaka's personal commission. He oversaw the entire project himself. So if it weren't for Yorinobu, nobody would have found out. And if not for you, the project would not have been a success. This is a true breakthrough. Yeah, yeah, great. Your tech works. Now get it out of me. Well, well. I would have to see it first. Whoa, we just met. Haven't built up that sort of trust yet. How did you think this was going to go? If you want me to help you, I must examine you. Okay. Hmm. Unbelievable. It looks like... Can't believe this Seuss the one who's gonna help us. Impressive, isn't it? What a pity I won't be able to examine it fully. Yeah, real shame. You could have been his guinea pig, too. Tell me how to get rid of it. I'm afraid I have bad news. Your neural network has completely deteriorated. It can no longer function independently of the chip. The only thing I could Woo do... Woohoo, it's bargaining time is to give you information on a good clinic in Sweden. They'll help you through the terminal stages. Minimize the pain. Wait, you said the project was in the trial phase. You don't actually know how it'll end. Oh, I do. I just saw the construct devouring your brain. It's programmed to take over its new environment. At all costs. And your little meat brain is helpless against it. So no matter what, sooner or later the engram wins. Yes. And from what I've heard about Silverhand, that seems to be exactly his style. Huh. I see my reputation's grown into Arasaka legend. What exactly is going on in my head? You tell me. What's it like to have two personalities? Because it's not like you're hearing voices. You are both yourself and Silverhand, simultaneously. didn't come here for the philosophy lecture. It's not philosophy. It's neurobiology. And your evidence just confirmed my hypothesis. Have you noticed the construct's influence on your decision-making? Sheesh, give it a rest. When it comes to my decisions, Johnny really is just a voice in my head. Maybe he has a different opinion, but he can't make me do anything. Agreed 100%. You are one fucking stubborn. It's not host. as if one of you wins the debate. <laughs> The scale simply shifts, slowly but surely. Know what? That's enough. You just playing for time, because I can't tell. Are you trying to convince me you're useless? So I mean, in that case, I can just shoot you in the head and save us both some time. Ah, oh, finally. I will try to help you, if you come with me to Kang Tao. I'll try, just isn't gonna cut it. Actually, it's almost like you're trying to buy your way in with the Chinese. At my expense. Do you even realize how much data is in your head? Even if I can't help you, the data must be saved. Well, fuck me sideways. What a half-brain gonk. He just admitted you're right. Forget Kang Tao. Got any other ideas? If you think there's anyone else who can help you, I could give you the blueprints. Complete project documentation. Kang Tao offered quite the sum for it. You got it with you? He's got to gonk's fucking useless without him. Me? Hey, Takamura? What the hell is he doing here? He's got a few questions of his own for you. You play nice, he might even save your ass. I'm almost done. The blueprints.
better than nothing. Long as we find someone fluent in techno babble. What'll you do with them? I haven't decided yet. Are you serious? You know me. I can be impulsive. He's all yours. I'll give you two some space. I hope we can come to an understanding. That is certainly in your best interest. V, I will remember this. Ah, this heat. My throat is positively parched. See that? Fuck me. Just look at that. That is not me. You will see me differently. I will. But. Sons of bitches. You really are paranoid. You don't see it? Way corpse are stripping our world and lives naked, piece by piece? Can't turn a blind eye to that. This is the part where you divulge your master plan to annihilate Arasaka? No. It's the part where I say I despise petty merc thieves who think they're hot shit rebels after setting foot in the afterlife. Might think you took on Arasaka, but you're just a bug they scraped off the sole of their boot tossed in the trash. Ain't the only one to get flatlined by Sokka. Except I didn't let him scoop out my mind. Did you lock it in a trinket? Ha. Huh. I brought war to their doorstep, kid. Your grand plan? To steal their fucking car. You're a dick, you know. And you're a cunt. Maybe we'll fit together after all. What a line. <laughs> You seem to know a lot about my past. Best of friends! Well, seen flashes of your past, just like you've seen flashes of mine. Pisses me off that our memories blend. Don't have my own anymore. Ship's the worst thing never fucking happened to me. Mean to say I haven't earned the top spot yet. An arrogant asshole's no small problem, but it ain't my biggest. Dying is. Death by becoming someone else. You didn't do anything to deserve that fate. My memories, what do they feel like? Not following you. Aside from what you see and hear, I mean, you process or experience any feelings. Anger, regret, bitterness, fear. Though honestly, can't tell if they're yours or mine. You afraid of death? I'm afraid of wasted opportunities. Like Arasaka Tower? Came through it as you can see. And I ain't done with them yet. Your goal is to bury Arasaka. Demolish it. Mine's to stay above ground. Seem pretty clearly defined, both. Actually aligned pretty nicely, too. You need Mikoshi to save your life? That done, I can burn it to the ground. There it is. The Crusade. Get to Mikoshi, smash the system. Okay. I'll tell you why I want to destroy Arasaka, but I'll only tell you once. Wanna hear it? All right. I saw a corpse strip farmers of water, and eventually of land. Saw them transform Night City into a machine fueled by people's crushed spirits, broken dreams, and emptied pockets. Corpse have long controlled our lives, taken lots, and now they're after our souls. Come on, don't exaggerate. V, I've declared war not because capitalism's a thorn in my side or out of nostalgia for an America gone by. 
This war is a people's war against a system that spiraled out of our control. It's a war against the fucking forces of entropy. Understand? Do whatever it takes to stop them, defeat them, gut them. If I gotta kill, I'll kill. If I need your body, I'll fucking take it. Fucking hell. You still don't see it, but you will one day. Vibes. He said the thing. <laughs> he said the thing, guys. He said Cyberpunk 2077. Know what? Get the feeling this Grimes was really turning you on. Mm-hmm. Bet you see worse things in those shiny city apartments. I don't understand why we couldn't just stay in the car. Mm. This place just reminds me of dates with my ex-wife. Same goes for your whining, actually. <laughs> Got him. Oh, that's a essay. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, like, what a response. <laughs> You'd be better off just saying nothing. some levels to apply anyway. It's been a minute. Restores 25% health. Okay. I need to make sure I'm using those finishes more, so maybe getting some skills that... or, or perks that buff the, uh, the finisher ability. I don't know if I can block with Mantis Blades, though. Hmm. Oh. 
So... I want to check in over here. Hmm. Hello, we haven't met. I'm Elizabeth. My husband and I, we need a somewhat delicate matter handled. We think you could help. Am I asking who your husband is? Actually, who are you? I'd rather not discuss details over the phone. Please, meet with us. We'll explain everything. As I said, it's a rather delicate matter. Why call me of all people? Any particular reason? You came recommended. Yeah, who by? I'd rather not say. Not over the phone. Is there any way we could meet? Discuss some details? Sure, let's do that. I'll send you the address. See you. We could do that next. That's quite a good uh, job. I enjoy it. Yeah, they really don't want me moving the car any further that way, do they? Alright. Sup fam? It's cracking. Now that guy's just tripping in the corner. And this kid is just sat here like... Hey, guess what? I don't talk to strangers. I was trying to pull the gun out. He did look like he was, he was, he was on some hard stuff. <laughs> Just enjoying his corner vibe. <laughs> and was having a whole rave in his head. Please tell me you got the gun on. I want to see what you got in stock. Browse to your heart's content. Oh, I got this sick revolver though. Actually, really nice. Oh, I still don't have the damn rifle. They got this thing, but it's uh, it's not what I'm looking for. But it'd be better than. Oh, hang on. Precision rifles count as assault rifles. Uh. I still don't know if I have, like, any components above. No, I still don't. I've got a couple of purple boys. I need more greens, though, that's for sure. I really have no idea where you're supposed to get them from. Still not figured it out. I guess you just got to scrap stuff, maybe. Maybe I'll check in with a junk dealer as well. Um, oh, we can go check out Dex's body as well. Dex did the shine. What, what, was, what was the quote? The fat ass black Jesus of the afterlife. Ample indeed. I think I'm just going to have to start scrapping rather than selling them. 
thing is, I don't really need loads of money right now. So that's 45 damage. Want to see what you got? Oh. Um, this is oh shit, oh shit. Forty-eight grand though for a gun, like <clears throat> it's a bit, it's a bit of money right there. Seventy-six, fifty-five, and the difference in price is only like I don't know it's it's a lot. <laughs> Oh man, it, guns are so expensive in this game. It's like a lot of money for a gun. I don't think I want to spend that, actually. Uh, I'll spend that money on the rifle that I'm looking for, but not, not pistol. Uh, hi? I want to get myself chipped. Straight to the point. I like it. Bit more capacity to use as well now we've leveled up as well, 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 well. I can also upgrade one of these now, so. Uh, the armor would be wise, really, wouldn't it? So, I, can up I don't have that many, do I? Maybe I do. Um, or it's 14,800 to just buy it outright. Let's, uh, may as well put that on. I'll be able to use grenades though, I don't think. But that's fine. Fuck it. Oh, there's only seven. Can still upgrade it. Um. Yeah, just keep going. Fuck it. Send it. More perps. Perfect. That capacity. Okay. Sweet. These are a waste, almost. It's 27 grand to just buy the blues. It's not that much more in damage, either. Well, actually. 43 to 54. Per hit. Uh, I want to use melee weapons. They just don't feel like they're variable at the moment for me, and I don't know why. If I've built into my stats wrong... Anytime I've used them, I've just been sat there out in the open going slash, 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 nothing's happening. Time to kill with it is way too slow.
feel like I really need that. Hey Todd, doing good my man, doing good, just, just, just binging, binging the game, getting stuck in, having a good time, yeah. I hope you're doing well mate. How is it, it's, it's a big, it's a big update, it's... Expansive. It's going to take some getting used to, that's for sure. But everything's been positive so far. Um, a couple of things have struck me as taking a while to get used to, but yeah, everything's been positive. I'm really pumped for the DLC. It's coming real soon as well, so. Um. That six times optical zoom and scanning or aiming sounds interesting. That's cooler tuned, okay. Hold up on those. Oh, hang on. Some better sound of distance. I should buy one of these. That's it's not so good that one. It doesn't sound so good anyway. I guess the more in air damage stuff sounds neat. This game, I couldn't tell you what it is US, but the game is on discount right now. Nice, Todd. Yeah, they do a bundle where you can buy the base game with the DLC that relaunches in like five days. But if you just want to buy the base game, and yeah, it's uh, it's quite reasonable for the amount of game you get. I think anyway. But I appreciate probably a big commitment out of the bat. I don't know. If you've been watching this and you like the look of it, then I think it'll uh, it'll earn its value. This is um some of these are not very good. It's the same one I've got now, but what's the difference? Eight same 50 and then 5 it's just plus 5 crit chance that's it don't 
don't say discount. <laughs> I don't think it's going to get cheaper than that for a while. That's the biggest sale they ever usually have on the base game. It's like, what is it, 50% off, roughly? And if you're only just getting into it, I don't think DLC is really necessary for the bat, but you'll save a few bucks if you do get it with the DLC off the bat. It's 40%. Yeah, I don't think they've had a 50% one yet. And if they have, maybe they've only had it when the pre-orders for... Phantom Liberty first went up. I'm going to leave that. These... Defensive coffee. Way too taxing. These are cool attuned and I don't want those. I'll just put this back on for now. Hey, look, it's Cheeseburger Guy! He's jamming. His name's Scooter. Cheeseburger. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Well, I really need this otter. Uh, no. I have cumin and chili. Cheeseburger. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. <laughs> You just vibing? You are literally just standing there. Cool. I can just fast travel out of here, can't I? Cheeseburger in paradise. Mm, cheeseburger. Mm, 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 mm. I'm going to go here first. Event of Acid Rain, Pog, Acid Rain, my favorite. Where's Kitty? Kitty! Kibi!
wonder who will get in the mirror. I suppose I need to go and look for those crafting components, eh? Some bright shoes right there. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Fuck it all, baba. <laughs> the shoes. <laughs> uh. As Jay would say, that is the drip. I think that's what all the kids say. Isn't it? Got the drip. Certified dripping. <laughs> oh my god, that reminds me. I've got to, I've got to mention this because it's, it's in my mind. Um, I found this mod on the Nexus for Fallout 4. And it's called Dripping Cox. And I thought that's pretty inappropriate, and then I saw it, and it's just chickens, all chickens in the universe, have really sick high-top Nikes or something. <laughs> they're all just wearing... <laughs> I've got to find it. I don't even know what shoes they're... Yeah. Tell this out. <laughs> the rad roosters or whatever. Yo. <laughs> Look at the drip of that cock. <laughs> oh, yeah, the, the third picture. <laughs> Oh, look at him go, boy! Look at him go! <laughs> Best mod on Fallout 4, really. Sim settlements to eat your heart out. Not really liking the green orange combo. I'll be honest with you. It's not it's not doing it for me. I don't know. I don't look like a dripping cock, do I? It's just not It's just not it. You need to buy some smart shoes so I can get suited.
For now, I think um, we we'll just stick with what we got. Reaching, <laughs> reaching the end point of the internet. Nice. The fuck is all this? The fuck is V doing? What is all that? Just saw the log change. That's for. That's for true. Kitty. <laughs> That's his trip. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Well, like his um, his drip tabs for his uh for his bong or whatever. Hey man, you want a drip? <clears throat> I need to run around some gun stalls and see if I can find the gun I'm looking for actually, because. The gun situation I've got right now is it's just not it. It is not it. Be new gun owner, I hope. Ow. Ow. Woo! Before we do that, let's go downtown. Downtown drip shop. Maybe we should go buy the drip. Then we then we can take the fight to the cock. This is the Nate Lops and No Context Hour. Brought to you by Dripping Cox. Let me in! Oh, it's the fourth floor, isn't it? <laughs> Cyberpunk Pro Tip! Buy your drip! Are you getting what you want? What kind of heat are you packing? Thought you never ask. Yeah, there it is. That's what I've been looking for. This bad boy. It's got a slightly higher headshot damage multiplier. Oh, that's got a high headshot damage multiplier as well. God damn. Smart sniper rifle. I think I might need to just buy that. It's twenty five grand, though. Fuck it! You can have that. I'll leave it at that for now. Oh, you can put sights on this one now. I don't think you could put sights on this gun before. I think it came with its own weird hollow sight. That's neat. What kind of drip do you have for my guns, sir? Good sir! Please provide me the drip my guns require.
Let's just try that. Hi, George. Enjoy, man. <laughs> I like how the balaclava makes you three percent harder to spot. Neato. Another murder outside your bedroom window. Okay, let's now go to. I do with going to a med point, really. I will die. Let's test it out. Well, it would appear I died. I had good judgment at first. This is what happens when you, you, you get lazy and you don't want to take the elevator. Titanium bones are scared. Yeah, they're like dainty as fuck, bro. Alright, let's go to the med point. I'm going on foot, fuck it. And when I say on foot, I mean like mostly in the air. What kind of medicine do you specialize in? I'm actually a bioengineer. But don't worry, I've taken out my fair share of lead, too. I'd like to use your services. Am I going to regret it later? Come again? You look like someone who's seen a lot of... gets into all sorts of... unsavory predicaments. <laughs> You'd be right. But don't worry, I won't drag you into any of these so-called, uh, predicaments. Well, all right then. That's all you've got. That's all you've got. That's it. It wasn't worth the conversation. Right out of my mouth, girl. Besides. God damn. All right. Um. A real woman can look. We're gonna run a kilometer, all right? And by run, again, traverse. Fast in the traffic, technically. Yeah, <laughs> I want to see this from like a bystander, uh, a bystander's perspective. You know, I want to. <laughs> oh. ah. <laughs> it's not going well. What can I do for you? 
Yeah, I think I'm getting the gist of it now. And the gist is that this fucking sucks. I don't like this. I don't think you can buy components. I was hoping that maybe that one place just didn't have them anymore. I think you've just got to scrap shit for them now. It's the only way to get them. And loot. Which if I had known... I would have invested in a perk early, way earlier on, right at the beginning of the session today. That means that I loot more. Which... I don't like it. Yeah. Alright. The, the biggest negative I've got so far... Is that... I feel obliged to get this, uh, this perk. Hmm. Yeah. I guess I need to stop selling stuff. Combine. Huh, interesting. Oh. Uh... Okay, so you can upgrade lower quality ones. Into the next level. Oh, okay, that... That helps. That that helps a lot. It's still not great because the conversion rate on those is shit. But <laughs> if you look now, I've yeah, that that is terrible actually. <laughs> God damn! How many greens do I need to do a single blue? Five. It's a five to one. That sucks. This all fucking sucks. <laughs> they really don't want you getting fully equipped. They always want you left wanting more, it seems. What's that? Cyberware? What am I crafting right now? I'm crafting nothing. <laughs> That's a bug. Okay, uh... Could do a bit more before I call it a stream. I just don't know what. Well, let's do that for a bit of fun. Go get the edge runners a jacket. David Martinez.
Oh. My car is still here, what? Hmm. I don't feel like I remember it being there. me shooting from here okay I thought that was a built-in gun oh yeah I've got like a actual rifle now I should use that I like this gun, it's pretty good. It sounds like a V10 to me. <laughs> Sorry, lady. Oh. oh, interesting. Time to get DMCA'd because anime.
Will you? What in the fuck? <laughs> what in the fuck? I just double tapped that. I did not mean to. <laughs> oh look, I am on a lamppost. <laughs> How very cool. <laughs> Sucking suits. Fuck you looking at. Nothing to see here. Move along. Is this how Night City's finest protect and serve? Why? You want to be some kind of hero? I don't care. I don't know him. So, why the fuck we talking? I like to know what's going on around me. It's not every day you see a man in a thousand eighty suit getting beaten within an inch of his life. Wouldn't you agree? He put a girl into a coma. Daughter of a friend. Run skiff for an XBD. Second one. From what I can tell, your guy's a mid-level manager. And? The corp won't let this slide. They'll pull the data from this asshole's biomon and find you. And then, they'll shoot you. 
You think I don't know that? Fucking corpos walking around like holy cows in a two-piece. But I ain't letting them go. No fucking chance. I'm not asking you to. What I want is for you to let me finish the job. Yeah? And what's in it for you? Nothing. It's just how I unwind. All right. Let's go, boys. Take care of yourself, officer. Rise and shine, Corpo Swine. For you, I'd be... Well, thank you. Were you sent by the company? Wrong answer. Then, hold on. What do you want from me? The truth. What do they want from you? have no idea. They said something about some slut and a virtue. But when I asked what I had to do with it, they started beating on me so hard, I thought I'd die. Ah, uh, this city's really going down the drain. For the police to do this in plain sight for no reason. <laughs> Go on. Get out of here. But... I don't understand. Just like that. For nothing in return. Nothing. I... I don't... I don't believe you. You saved me just like that because you... felt like it? Don't measure others by your own yardstick, prick. <laughs> Yeah, prick. Oh my god, it actually avoided me? My god. My lawyer's gonna go data crash on your ass. You hear me? He'll run you out of biz. Would you be so kind as to give me your lawyer's contact information? Fuck you, Sirk Brain! Thank you. Processing data now. Please wait. Uh... Hey, Del. Hello, sir or madam. How can I be of hey, service? Hey. What's got what into you, Del? Tonight? Don't recognize me? You sent me a message saying I should come in about the accident. You are currently speaking to a Delamay Network subroutine. Alas, my operational capabilities are limited. Could you please clearly recite your incident report? Don't give them any numbers. That's how they find you. Who? Uh, 77 Incident report on file. Confirm. 96 at the end. It's a public enemy. Government target. Your identity has been established. Mr. Hans Jonas. What phrase would best describe your experience of incident number 77111110096? Yeah, prime accident. I shit green apples. Now get me the real Delamain. V. My apologies if the receptionist was a bother. 
I'm preoccupied with the crisis that is ongoing, and I simply cannot oversee everything. I've taken the liberty of transferring a settlement to your account to compensate for the damage done. Ah, special treatment. Would you mind if we spoke elsewhere? Sure, let's talk. Then please, follow the drone. I'm fully aware customer service is less than satisfactory at the moment. Perhaps a guided tour will prove some form of compensation. This corridor links the shop to the office. And here is where the magic happens. The shop is fully automated. I'm pondering broadening my portfolio to include repair services. Alas, the shop is currently overwhelmed with work. I think I know why. I'm still looking into the cause of the Delphi network. My working hypothesis is an advanced virus. I must resolve the situation quickly. This sudden rise in incidents is proving costly, aside from drawing unwanted attention to the company. Control room. I feel honored to have you here. Rather, surprisingly. Control rooms are for Ganics. What good is it to you? There was a time this facility was human operated. I simply inherited their infrastructure. All these lights, what are they for? That's what I wish to discuss with you. A green light denotes a vehicle with which I am in contact. As you can see, that is no longer the case for some vehicles. Those are the red lights. Repair drones can't take care of this? This time, I fear, human intervention is required. I'm aware you offer a broad range of services and are unusually discreet. Thus, I'd like you to assist me in recovering my missing vehicles. Why is discretion a concern? Unnoticed, unbothered, right? In my case, broadly tolerated. Yet a marked increase in inspections suggests the authorities have begun monitoring me. Talking NCPD or Netwatch? The latter. My legal status does not fit neatly within current regulations. If I'm not careful, I could easily be categorized as an illegal immigrant. Okay, sure. I'll go after you missing wheels. I'm pleased to hear it. I shall send you the coordinates of their last known locations. You must simply deactivate each. I'll then re-establish the link and return them to my garage. See what I can do. Delamain vehicles are exceptionally secure. Be sure to have a scanner with decryption capability on your person. Alright. Alright, should we go and do some of these? These are quite fun. Yeah, shitting green apples, imagine. Too much stuff to do, not enough time. I'm not used to there being other people driving like absolute mad cunts on the roads now. That's new. Ugh. Ouch. Bike's slow, man. One of 
my missing vehicles might very well be near where you are now. Thanks. Try to find it. Let's get you back to safety. The garage. By driving through the streets. Well, uh, yeah, afraid so. Fine. Take me there. Just get me out of here. Let me know when I'm safe. You're welcome in, but do take it slow and try not to hit anything. As you command. What's considered slow, chat? <laughs> I suppose you'll start screaming if I go too fast. Too fast. Oh, okay, yeah, 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 alright. Fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> well, I wasn't wrong. <laughs> uh, don't crash into stuff, he didn't like that either. I guess anything over 55 is going to be too fast, right? Maybe 60. He hasn't complained too much. There is still a, a HDD mode in the game, amusingly. I thought there was like a camera height adjustment. Yeah, here we go. It's on low already? Okay, well, I'm definitely not putting it on high. Car sounds beefy. I just noticed something I don't think I was supposed to notice. So, this game's in first person, right? Most of the time. So you never feel like there's a need for facial animations. Well, I was just watching my character's face and they were talking. But they weren't just talking for their lines, they were talking for Delamain's lines as well. Am I possessed by Delamain? You might be able to see it if you rewind. I could probably use your help. Probably. Fine. I could really use your help. Can we meet? Deep breaths, Pan Am. Tell me what's going on. Do you remember We're going to die. the leader of the clan I left? Yeah, yeah. I had a fallen out or something. Doesn't matter right now. He... They nabbed him. This is just not suitable for a call, V. Just tell me when and where. You don't know how good it is to hear that. Swing by the Alder Caldos camp. I'll explain it all. Find the Alder Caldos. Thought you oh, parted ways. I should be alone here. Oh, look, See? it's a long story. It wasn't so bad. Just hurry it was over. horrifying. I'm here. But still, I thank you. 
Sincerest thanks for your assistance, V. I've taken the liberty to send you a share of your fee. Someone was out to kill me. <laughs> All right. Let's um. Let's go meet with Pan Am. Well, this will do, I suppose. I keep pressing up twice on the D-pad. Um, what the fuck? Um, why are they shooting my car? What? It's a wraith. Wait, what the fuck? Who's fighting here? I can't even pull my guns out here. Fuck just happened. You ain't too likable. Well, cheers. You're coming with me. <laughs> ah! No, I didn't mean it. It was just okay. I'm dead. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> Instant regret. I couldn't even put him down again. I was like, <laughs> Oh, fuck's sake. 
Well, you know what? Maybe that's a good place to call it. <laughs> that's a mission. Well, I could fast travel, but also... Long. I think it's about time I call it a stream anyway. We've been live for 8 hours and 10 minutes. God damn, haven't streamed this long in a while. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. You know? I'm rusty on these long boys. <laughs> anyway. Hope you enjoyed. I'll be back again tomorrow. Hopefully start a bit earlier. And maybe go just as late. We'll see. We'll see how alive I am. But yeah, thanks for watching. And um, yeah, I'll, I'll catch you tomorrow. Take it easy.